All right. Well, it's my hope that you can actually hear me right now. And act <laughs> hold on a second. I got to make sure that I, I'm not duplicating my sound here. I've got a little bit of a monitor going on behind me to see what is happening. And we'll see what happens with the uh, live streaming. Uh, good evening to those of you who are able to hear me, if you're able to hear me. <laughs> Assuming you're able to hear me. I'm here, live editing my vlog as you do. And uh, hopefully, I'm checking the comments here to see if you guys can hear me. Let me know if you can. It looks like it's Anna says she can hear me. I got to mute my, uh, my dang telephone here so you can't hear me again in the background. Good, glad you guys can. Thanks, Anna. Love it. Oh, you just turned on the light. Perfect. I needed you to do that. I needed somebody to do that. Anyways, let's uh, let's let's transition over to uh, what we're gonna be doing here today. We're gonna be doing a live edit. Oh, thanks, Anna. Look at that. It came up. You can see the zombie chasing you there. Hopefully, we're gonna see how long this delay is. Also, if if we get any, if you hear any um, echoes or you hear me talking like duplicated Yanni's over in uh chat over on Twitch. So if you want to watch this on Twitch, you, your chat will show up on the screen. I don't know why it's not showing up. I got to work out some of the details as to how to get it all to show up on the screen on YouTube as well from the YouTube comments, but I'll be able to bounce back and forth to see, you know, everybody. Let's see if I can get it to multi-stream account going over here. It's got a thing over here. It's theoretically that's supposed to show me. Yes, I can see. Okay. There's Yesenia saying bonjour. Perfect. Okay, cool. Now I can see everybody's chat on the side. This is really, really cool. I'll show you my whole setup one of these days so you can see what all is going on. But uh, I'm going to be hanging out and uh, editing my video from today live. It's a really simple video. I haven't chosen my music yet, so you're going to get to sort of see that process. Um, it's an entirely new setup uh, right now. It's 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 not, well, it's not entirely 100% new, It's and we're in transition. I still have a little ways to go. Um, but I think it looks pretty good. How does it look? You can hear me okay. Everything looks all right. Oh, you got your sourdough. That's good, Susan. I'm glad to see that. Um, Yeah, Rachel, come and go as you please. I'm probably going to be here for the next couple of hours. Uh, let me mute this for a second. Close my windows there uh, so I'm not annoying the neighbors. Thanks for everybody watching. Feel free to like it as you go. Feel free to watch on uh, YouTube or on Twitch. I'm streaming on both right now as an experiment to see how this goes. I hope it works really well. I can make myself bigger too, actually. I've uh, I've been playing around with this, trying to figure out how to make uh, my live edits lots better, infinitely better. Thanks to my patrons for making that possible because, uh, you know, they pay me and I take that money and I put it right back into making everything look nicer. Hopefully, it's part of the goal. So, I got a little bit of music going behind me that's not going to be in today's vlog. So, I'm going to stop that here in a second and I'm going to try and find... Um, our audio for today just making sure that i've actually got all my video stuff dumped in here missing some files which you'll see pop up when i make myself smaller but what we want to do before that before we get too into that is actually want to find some new music and i've got some fancy stuff that we can do thanks monster cat we're gonna go ahead and stop monster cat now i hope Oh, it's popped out another window. That's why. Pause. Cool. Cool, cool. Cool, cool, cool. Sounds like we don't have too much buzzing coming through my microphone right now, which is good as well. Hi, Christine. Sebastian. Martin. Good to see you guys all hanging out. A little lockdown dance. How's that? Now that we don't have any music, it's just weird. Um. So, yeah, I'm on, I'm on YouTube and Twitch. I've been Twitch streaming a lot lately, um, which has been a lot of fun. It's been really good. It's kind of like exactly what I uh, needed anyways. And um, now, uh, you know, I still got to make videos and stuff, which is all the all the rage. And I need to figure out what song I'm going to play today. Um, I think I have some stuff from Diala that I haven't used yet. I got to look at my... Um, I have an entire spreadsheet with all the songs that I've ever used in every almost every video. Um, definitely missing some of them, unfortunately. But... That's a little bit way too intense. Let's move this over. Actually, I guess I don't need to move that out of the way because we're just going to be doing this. Got to find one that fits the day. It's a little bit... Oh, you know what? There was a song. There was. I want something kind of airy because I did 
when I was out and about running, that's I like this one a lot. Um, it just felt very like chill. So I've got a couple of long shots that I want to do. You'll see how the weather is here in a second. Uh, but I got to find, oh, actually, what about this guy? No. Sometimes I wish, see, normally I would do this. I would not do this on a live stream because this is just a really subjective. Hey, thanks for the follow. Those following, I don't know. Let's see. It's kind of confusing because there's a mixture of um, Twitch and YouTube notifications that are going to be going on on the screen. So we'll see what all that means as we go. I think a follow is on Twitch, though. So thanks to the person who followed on Twitch. Should mix it in there. If you want to say hi, I'll see it. Boom. Thanks for that subscription. Appreciate it. We'll also see if you super chat, you'll see the color of the light behind me change. I'm going to keep adding more and more fun little things to this to uh, try and, uh, you know, intensify the gamification of our of our delight. Oh, this song. I love this song. The problem is I'm also, I, I, I lost two years of my music library when my computer got stolen. So I'm kind of lacking. And this one to me, this is one of, I don't remember which, this one's been used in a video that was a little more popular, I think. But I want to use it. It doesn't actually tie, it's not, it's not what I imagined originally I was going to be using for this video, but we're going to use it now anyways. I also found some of my animations. Um, I have to rebuild a couple of them, but let's pull this guy out. Let me pull him out of the, here, I'll show you. I'm going to go back to the main view so you can kind of see what I'm doing down in the corner. Um, I'd like to pull her out of this folder if possible. I don't know why it's not letting me. There we go. And then I'm going to pull in some overlays that I recently rediscovered just today, which makes my life so much better um, to have some of these available. I'm going to drop, I don't know if we're going to use all of them, but I'm going to drop them all in here. These are the animations that I usually drop in. I made these in After Effects. Like I found, a, I don't know if it was a tutorial or a template online, but I found these and I was able to uh, customize them. Can you see that? Oh no, we're going to have a problem. If you can't see the video on the screen, we might, we might run into some severe technical difficulties right off the bat. Let's see what happens when I drop this in here. Oh no, you can't see either of these. That's a problem. That's a really big problem. Okay, let's try. Hold on. We're going to have to badoop add. Uh, 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 oh, is it, does it count them as a separate window? That. Hold on, cancel. Thank you. Oh, thanks, Jose. Appreciate that. Okay, I'm going to see if I can't. Um, I need to find another window capture. Add source. That's the Premiere capture. Add a new source instead. Um, video question mark. <laughs> Add source. And let's hope that there's a separate one for Premiere. I don't see one. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. It's really bad. It's not good. How do we get this to work? Sound capture one store. Oh, good, great, googly, moogly. This is quite the new problem. What if we do an entire display capture? Let's see if that works. So we have window capture. What about display capture? Add source. Add source. Display, nope, that's not what we want. Display one. Oh, it's showing nothing. That's not good. Sorry I had to launch right into some technical difficulties. You can see and hear um, what's going on here. Let's go, I need to open my preferences, audio hardware, and put this guy out to the roadcaster. Uh, yeah, let's give that a try. Hopefully that works. Okay, now we can hear it. There we go. So here's the thing. You can hear me wailing on my bike, but you can't. You can hear that, right? But you can't see it. That's not good. Why is it not working? Okay, let's try. Let's try game capture. Maybe a game capture is what we need. How are you doing? <laughs> I do, uh, yeah, if you want to, I mean, listen, uh, thank you. Oh, Monster Walking on YouTube. 
Is there a monster walking? Uh, yeah, Lita, Lita, thank you. Um, if you, I mean, if you want to pitch in, either way is always great. Um, Kofi actually goes straight to me as opposed to Super Chats, like 30 to 40%. I'm not sure what it is. Some high percentage goes to YouTube, which, to be fair, they are enabling this, so I cannot hold that against them. Um, but, yeah, however it works. And Hypothermia, thanks for jumping back over to Twitch. It's fun. I see you there, S S L G A L pin as well. Hi Rosie, Meridi, Iliasis, everybody. Um, sorry that this is taking. Hold on, we're gonna get this figured out. This is a this is a trial run. This is a trial run. We're gonna get this figured out. Ain't no problem. Lack of problem. A problem. Let's see if game capture works. Add source game capture. Oh, that's not what we want. Hum dum 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 dum. Oh. Oh, 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 did that work? Is there a window? Premiere, uh, yep, Premiere Pro. Done. Is that going to work? No. Well, flu for Nugans. This is unfortunate. Because if I cannot, if you can't see what I'm actually editing, oh my gosh, on my TV behind me, I've is got the, I, I can't, I, I've got my phone going here so I can see the chat. That's what I was checking originally. But I've got it running on my TV over behind me as well as another monitor. And I just saw the, like, looking for video game screen that just jumped up there. That was monstrous. But that way I can see what you guys can see. And, um, it loops. A dream catcher. If only the dream catcher could catch these dreams. I need to plug in the yellow cord. Perfect. I'll make sure to plug that yellow cord in right away, Dixie. Thank you so much. She's got, she's got this one nailed. So the problem is, I think the problem is, this is something that's happened before. What I need to change, thank you. I don't know if it's too late to do this. Let's see if I can open my NVIDIA control panel and fix this without crashing literally everything. Oh, good. I haven't even got to agree to their license agreement first. I'm just going to narrate what's going on because you can't see what's happening. Okay. I am making the thing bigger, and I'm going to see if I can't adjust. Manage. I got to, um, which, oops, sorry. I got to figure out. Is it adjust image settings with preview? No, that's not it. But I did just click. Oh, not that. I feel like it's the... This is going to be real exciting. Maybe I should turn that music back on just so we got something going. Here we go. Thanks, Monster Cat. Appreciate that. Okay. We have Monster Cat at it back up here. Hopefully you enjoy a little bit of background music. Oh, lays in English. Okay, thank you very much. Sorry, I said that wrong. I wasn't sure if we had I's or L's going on there. Oh, look at that. Monster Cat's even telling you, at least on Twitch, what song is playing right now. That's cool. Hey, DJ. Welcome to the party. Best in the West. Boom. Rebonjour. Okay, so how do I do this without... I, it's not this setting. Oh, man. Okay, let's get rid of this. It's going to be in my NVIDIA settings, and I, but it's not in the control panel. Oh, boy. If you guys want to just hang out and watch me struggle, please do. Please feel free. Please feel free. So I need to... What I need to do, basically... So there's two things that are happening right now. Um, when you're editing on a machine like this, generally speaking, in layman's terms, because that's about as deeply as I understand it anyways, you have your Intel, your integrated graphics, right? And then you have your NVIDIA graphics. Um, or your graphics card. So there's a dedicated GPU. And then uh, you've got your Intel chip that's hanging out on your motherboard that's handling most of what you see, like web browsing, everything that's kind of generally going on. And then the heavy heavy uh, lifting gets offloaded to your GPU. So they're being operated in separate places. The software that's capturing this right now is capturing, can I think can only capture one or the other, which is, which is where the problem comes from. And normally what I would do is I would just switch between if, games or that you know you'd be like one or the other i've never had a problem though usually it was like you either had to be uh set up to stream for the games which are on the gpu or you'd set up for this which was usually in the intel graphics and so i don't know if the hardware is just rerouting things in a way that um is obviously unexpected because i was not ready for this um so if nothing else we'll just probably hang out and chat for a minute and then uh and then it'll be a very short non-live edit if i can't I can't edit live. 
Uh. <laughs> hey, system information is not what I need, but I'm kind of curious. Yeah, that's not what I want. Yeah, I'm on YouTube as well, DJ. I'm on both. Uh, yeah, welcome to lockdown in London there. Sorry about that. It's a reckless gambit. Yeah, it is the struggle bus. And I, it's apparently where I live. So, let me, I'm just going to do a quick Google for, um, let's see if I can do how to make OBS studio footage compatible. Nope. Nope. Crud. Everybody's going to want to import the footage into Adobe, but how do you stream? How do you stream Adobe? How do you stream? Streaming Adobe from your pro. Oh, please. Oh, please. See, I've done this on the, the simpler version of the software. Oh, no. This is what it's going to. Use display capture instead of window capture. But that's what I'm trying to do. Okay, hold on. Let's go back to. <laughs> see, what I can show you, what what I see on the other side is what you're about. You're about to see what my second monitor looks like. Because I'm going to add a display capture. And what that means is it's capturing everything on the screen. So if I add that source, currently it's not doing anything because I'm trying to show my first one. If I show my second one, boom. Oh my gosh. You can see what I can see. Whoa. So there's our audio down here and up here and up here and forever into an infinity over there. Here's where you're chatting. I've got both Twitch and the multi-stream chat so I can see all of you. Except uh, Dixie's over there on both as well, it looks like. Hey, Sue Ellis. So there you go. See, that's what I'm seeing over here, which is really nice because it's, it's really big and it's right by my um, laptop monitor, which is what I'm editing on. The tricky thing is if I go back to this, nothing happens. So I'm clicking over onto the <laughs> my uh, laptop monitor and it is totally blank, which is no good. Hmm. So we're going to go ahead and get rid of that useless display capture. Okay. What happens actually... Here's a question. Let's do that again. Let's try this again. Display capture. And we're going to add source and we're going to put it, we're going to set it to this guy here. Wow. Look at that. I love that. Whoa. Look at that delay. It makes it, f oh, it's so curly. The hand, look at the hand go. Okay. That's enough of that. I would do that for ever if allowed to. Oh, here's premiere. Oh, can you see it? If I do that, hold on. Could you, could you see it? Oh, shoot. Can you see it if I do that? I've got to, I'm going to wait and see what happens. I'm looking at my TV because you guys have a, you're, there's like a 30 second delay. And then I'll just move all of my monitoring stuff. This is going to be so confusing. I'm going to get a kink in the neck if, if this is how we end up doing this. I'm watching. It's about to happen. <gasps> oh my gosh, it works. Hot diggity dang. It has to do with the display being, uh, the display, I think maybe it has to do with the display resolution being 4K. So we're troubleshooting live. Welcome to Jay Swanson Troubleshoots Live, everybody's favorite blah, 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 blah. Okay, here we go. Let's try closing out of a bunch of stuff. I'm going to close out of Discord as well. Please do join that Discord server whenever you feel like it. It'll be great. Display settings. Okay, we're almost there. We're about to get there. If For those of you that have been patient enough to watch and wait through this and suffer with me. Oh, yeah, sorry. All you're seeing over here is, um, okay, well, hold on. We're going to go to 1980, wait, 12, wait, 1080 by 1920 over here. Oh my gosh, that looks terrible, but it's going to, it's going to work. So then if we go display capture, we edit it and we go display one, display one, display one, please. No. Dang it. Okay, well, we tried. So that means I'm going to have to edit to the side. Also, this music is getting way out of hand. Okay, so we're going to take this guy over here. And also, I'm going to restore my 4K settings so that I can fit more stuff on the screen. Get a little bit of dubstep in your life. I bet you didn't know that's what you were missing tonight, but it is exactly what you're missing. Okay, we're going back up to our full 4K resolution. Keep changes shenanigans okay this guy's gonna live over here 
Oh my goodness. Okay, and then Premiere is getting put over here. Oh, this is gonna hurt. This is gonna be so painful. Okay, here we go. This is where we're gonna be heading from here. Uh, I'm gonna actually edit and you're gonna be able to see things. <laughs> oh, oh my gosh, no. Okay, okay, <laughs> we can, this. we're gonna survive this. So let's move this down to underneath all the other stuff. We just gotta redesign our whole layout here really quick. Oops. I didn't mean that to happen. Okay. Okay. Under the chat box. Okay. There we go. And then we just resize it to be about yeah, like so. And there we go. That, like, that looks pretty good. Oh, this doesn't look great though. Oh, can we, can we crop? Yes, we can. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, even better. Oh dang. Hot diggity dang. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, I think we're in business. That took forever. I'm sorry about that. Okay. Well, where, how do I, how do I, um, pause this? I'd love to crossfade it out, but I don't think I have that ability. So there it goes. Oh, this is okay. Hold on. This monitor can move. Hopefully I'm not scraping against anything important over there. Nothing that can't be replaced. Okay. All right. Oh no, but now it's blocking the webcam. <laughs> Hold on. We got this. What are you? Oh, you're an old you're an old HDMI cable that nobody wants to nobody wants to be here anyways. No offense or anything, but okay. I think that is like propped up on my laptop. That's not good for the laptop. But Watch. Hold on a second. Goodbye for just a second. Technical difficulties. Oh, I just turned off the monitor. That's not what anybody wants. We're just breaking stuff left and right. Don't you worry. Thanks to Yanni and Mystery Man for making this outrageous setup possible. And there we go. It's now in front of me again. I'm going to post a picture of this on Discord if you want to see what I'm seeing now. You can go check it out there. I'm going to put it in the general chit chat. And then we're going to get started. I probably, I think I've earned a beer. I think I'm going to go get a beer now because, you know, Jiminy freaking Christmas. General chit chat. And uh, here's, here's the new setup. Can I get the full, there we go. Oh, here, let's put this, let's prop this guy up the way he's meant to be propped up. Makes it look that much more fun just because I have so many screens. And. Okay. Upload that. Send. My new setup. There we go. <sighs> okay. 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 I think I deserve this. And I'm gonna go get a. Uh, I'm gonna go get a beer. I also deserve that. I have a thing for that. Hold on. Wait for it. Wait for it. Okay, for those of you who are curious, I got the uh, Galea West IPA. It's one of the ones that I can get very easily from my local grocery store. And actually, it's also very good. It's a local brewery, Galea. They've been making beer here for a good while now. Since 1890, apparently. But they've recently upped their game because when I first discovered them, they were they were Okay. Maybe my taste hadn't matured enough yet to fully appreciate it. it. Actually, could all be me. Maybe it's not them at all. But I like them a lot now. Ah, cheers. Okay. Let's get to work. We have a lot of work to do. And um, oh, one more thing I'm going to do is I'm going to change, because this is really going to drive me crazy, display settings. I'm going to put that, that display on top of this display so that I can actually, when my mouse goes up, 
it goes onto the screen. Perfect. Okay, that's cool. So now this is so confusing, but you know what? We're going to get through it. Again with the IPA. That sounds so accusatory. Yeah. I mean, generally, I have some blonde beers back there, but I, they're kind of too sweet for me right now, and uh, I should probably get a lager or two. Okay, so what I was talking about when I was so rudely interrupted by the realization that I had made a huge mistake um, was that I found these overlays, which is really good because, like, these are the ones that I toss in every once in a while. I used to, I try to toss them in, like, once a video um, in the, the uh, you know, the off hope that somebody might follow me over on Instagram or Twitter or anything else or Twitch. I got my Twitch one in here too. I haven't been using that much, but now that I'm back on Twitch, like tonight, it's good to have that up there. And maybe instead of an at, that should be a slash. I don't know, but uh, you know, we're doing the best that we can. So, um, oh good. I'm, <laughs> no, I just, I, I, it's hard to, it's hard to read, you know, the text. You just never know. So, um, I actually don't know how to answer the India or West Coast IPA, to be honest. It depends on it depends on the beer, really. Because um IPAs, uh oh man, just of a variety are so good. So um anyways, on this one, so we found our song here. We dumped it in here. This is my this is kind of how I ooh, we should probably that's this phone that's vibrating. We need to turn that off so that doesn't obnoxiousize us as we go. Um so, uh, basically, the way that this works is I usually dump whatever the, the top or bottom uh, file is, and usually from my Sony, because then it puts it in at a particular, you know, at a given frame rate. Whereas with cell phone footage, it's variable. The, um, the Samsung does better than the Pixel did, so it's all right around 30 frames a second, even though it's not the same. It's, like, almost never actually the same as it should be. It should all look the same. Your frame rate should basically never change between any given file or camera. So, like, on the Sony, it's always 59.94 because it's currently set to 60 frames a second. So you'll see that it never changes because it's a professional camera. The cell phone footage is just a little bit off, which isn't really a problem. It probably just means that there's one or two frames that were either dropped or added along the way. And, um, you know, worse things have happened. So, and honestly, the footage off of it's been really consistent. So it's not bad. So what I'm going to do, I think I'm going to do kind of a more traditional intro here for the vlog. I don't have the other animation stuff I did. Whoa, these, look at the size of these icons. That is insane. Those are massive. Those are usually way smaller we're having some really fun resolution so those are those are set to a 4k resolution i think and they're being displayed on a high def resolution that's just really funny okay so i'm just gonna keep commenting on the little weirdnesses as they happen probably because that is just cartoonish to me but um gotta re reduce the audio gain by like six or seven decibels right off the bat just to make sure that it doesn't annoy everybody because i used to annoy everybody with my music being too loud and then hopefully you guys can hear that music as I go. What's up, Abdul? Cool. So it's really not the, um, I'm less sold on that song now that we've gone through all the chaos. So I have some of this fun, really blurry footage, but I put this down and was going to do a selfie cam shot and it just looked kind of cool the way it was. So I'm just going to throw this in here. And I've got a couple others, actually later ones where I actually was taking moving footage like this, I think. Yeah, and then it's just unfortunately the set, the cell phone didn't realize that I was trying to film it, you know. Um, landscape. Sorry, that took a lot out of me. That 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 hurt my brain just trying to figure all this out to get it to work so you guys could see what I was doing. Um, so we're going to rotate that boy to 90, like that. And we're going to move this in like this. Timing works out well on that. Okay. I'm just trying to get some good little leafy footage and so forth. So the nice thing is, and then what we want to do is, I think this is going to be our timed shot here so me running off in the distance whatever and what i need to do is i need to do that when the beat drops 
so we can throw in a lot of I don't I don't know I don't have a ton a ton of footage for today's video so we'll see what we can milk out of this so this is where that's gonna happen and then we're gonna hopefully it goes all the way back to yeah it does okay cool like that and so then it and then we can do some quick cuts after that so that'll look good I think I don't know if I'm allowed to say my own footage looks good or not. I think that could potentially be taken as mildly arrogant. All right, let's do this. I will say that um, this 4K screen makes my footage look... I'm always like, does, does it normally look this good? Because I don't... I, really? It just makes it look really nice. So boost, boost the old confidence a, a little bit. This guy, we got some like nice low leaf footage as well that doesn't have me in it, which is great. So the other question that I have now, stylistically speaking, is do I want to throw in some stuff from the project footage? Probably, maybe a little bit, just to feel like maybe that up here too instead of this moving footage because the thing is I also don't we don't want moving footage too soon because the whole idea is that it's like still while it's quiet and then the movement comes after the after the beat drops so we could do actually oh I didn't copy the other footage I have more footage is it in where's the camera I have more footage I need to dump I just realized here it is not just on the side of the microphone. So <laughs> you'd think that I'd you'd think that I'd know what I was doing at this point in my life and mini career, but you know, you'd be wrong. I gotta I'm working on getting integrating more self deprecating sound effects as I go. So let's see, here we go. Put this guy in here. You have a question. Do I know the topic still says it does it? No, really? In oh on Twitch? That's okay. I couldn't get it to change the game for whatever reason. But is the title CBA? Does the title say that it's the live edit at least? Hi Taya from uh New Zealand. And uh thanks, Abdul. I mean, you know, I'm I'm a little a little distracted, but hey. And yeah, there's a lot of work that goes into it for sure. Oh, I love this shot of uh, the screw. Here's another problem. Potentially behind it is actually that's the anti-lock kick nub that I don't fully understand. I need to go look into that and see what that's all about because it locks the wheel. And I think you have to unlock it with the app. Oh, that explains why the app hasn't been locking the bike. Oh, I get it now. Oh, I've been make I've finally figured that. Okay. And then um, I don't know, I just really like the shot of this screw right here. Is it the best shot in the world? No, but I kind of like it. It's cool. Title says edit. Okay, good. I'm glad. Thank you. Yeah, I appreciate that. Uh, unfortunately, on the game selection, I was trying to choose. It wouldn't let me choose anything in real life. I had a whole thing set up. I had to redo it. Um, I've made mistakes. I've made grave, grave errors <laughs> today in my life in general. I mean, really. Um, and that is made apparent. So this is going to take a minute to copy this footage over. But there is one shot in particular that I think would look real good. Um, pulled over and insert it into our little intro here, assuming that, oh no, maybe I have already pulled it over. It's just that the numbers changed because I had to delete a bunch of stuff. Uh, yeah, it's just up here. I hope this some of this, oh, this is, oh yeah, oh, money, money. Money. So then what we can do is we can reference back to shots that, um, we're already in here. So let's take this guy. Should we? I rode around a few times. Something like that. Oh, that bike looks so good. Happy birthday to me. Thanks, guys. And we'll use that one because I then I realized that the electric motor wasn't on. And I turned it on. And I redid it all again. And I scared this woman twice. She walked out and like was scared to see me riding by in my mask. When she did not expect that. Uh, but what I was going to do is, I was going to say is we can get, there's me going up. We'll get the, there we go. Get a little bit of the flashing lights. And, whoa, that's way too much. Let's grab this guy like this. 
Let's get it right on the flash. Cause that'll look a lot better. There you go. And then it, and you get the opening doors, which kind of gives you that sense of anticipation, like, what's going to happen? And then people are like, what? Well, I've got to watch this video to know why the doors are opening. Are there stormtroopers coming? What's happening? That's the goal, at least. Okay, so I did my job. I didn't need to dump more footage. Turns out I'm... I was wrong about my wrongness, so I was right, but thought that I was wrong. Okay. I think... I think we're good to go from here. Now, I have to hand make the titles. Oh, my gosh. These cursors are insane. They're just stupid. All right. So, Jay Swanso, we need to change our text here to the usuals. Want that. Do that. And then vlog a day 1254. It's a lot of, a lot of vlogs. Who knew that I'd still be doing this? Oh, shoot, wrong one. I started this. I started blogging daily basically during the last presidential campaign, um, which is crazy to think about. Shoot, I keep doing this wrong. That was right. Um, yeah, that's crazy to think uh, I'll have been blogging in, mul uh, yeah, anyways, multiple generations of political activity i don't mean to take this into politics just obviously the election is uh tomorrow yeah so on the brain but we won't talk about it okay so this guy that looks kind of good right there actually too i like that i'm gonna do that and i'm gonna i'm gonna what I, one of the things i've been doing is i've been introducing the vlog number later like that Then we'll put the then when I then I'll just copy this guy over and we'll repurpose it for the location and date. Like so. Um what's today? <laughs> November 2nd, 2020. Good grief. You know what's crazy is actually in confinement, the days are already flying by for me. I have so much work to do and just so much, you know, like, oh, this might not be night. This might oh, let's try to put it right in the middle of this green patch and hopefully. That does the trick, so you can read it well enough. Yeah, that's fine. And then we're going to do some quick cuts here because that felt really dissatisfying that it wasn't that quick a second ago. That's fun. Uh, we can also do something that, oh yeah, actually it's going to be down here. Jeez. So you can tell, so this, this file number 13, I hate how, I hate how cameras like real, like the, the one thing, maybe the frame rate is variable on the phones, but phones naming structure for this. So this is just, this is niche. You're showing up to watch a dude edit a video and drink a beer. So you're going to get a lot of really nerdy insights, but it is really annoying how they name the file structures. Thanks, Bo. Appreciate that. Bo Wolf. Is that the Bo Wolf that I uh, that I once crossed paths with back in the days of Cheney of yore? That's what I was curious. There's so much to do. Yeah, it's great. It's great to have a lot to do. But anyway, so you see how this they, they do the file editing. I, I think I talked about this. I've talked about this before and I'm going to go into it in, in more in real depth someday. But when I talk about the videos, this is one of the reasons that Android is better than iPhone for video, like archiving at least, is that the date, it's, it goes by, you have your 2020, 1102, and then this underscore gives you the timestamp. So that's the date on the left and the time on the right. So I filmed this at 10.54.26. So 10 a.m., 10.54 a.m. and 26 seconds this morning, which is great. It's freaking phenomenal that you can do that because then it puts everything in the exact chronological, chronological order. Whereas down here, number one, I filmed long after I filmed number 224, right? <laughs> It's really, it's, 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 um, it's unfortunate just how these things work sometimes. Um, and so anyways, because I started deleting files, I got up to 2.30, I guess, and the card filled up. 
And so I deleted a bunch of files because I should have formatted the card like an adult beforehand. And then it just starts numbering over again at one and could potentially like jumble that up even more depending on what you delete. That's me being, that's my angry growl for, for now. So, hey, back to Rio de Janeiro. I would love to get to Rio someday. Okay. Um, so that means nothing makes sense. This is kind of fun though. I'm going to do some of these, more of these quick cut still shots. And then we got to, the thing is, maybe mm, we got to get into the running footage here by here though. So we might want to get into the quick cut sooner. No, I don't know that we can. The way that this works. Let's just go with this. Let's just have a nice long musical intro. Because I could do, we could do it like this. Let's just, I'm just going to drag these over to show you like the alternative here. Um, I'm going to get rid of this guy. Doom. Doom, 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 doom. So we need three. Like that would work. That looks kind of cool. This is really annoying that we have, we can get rid of that flicker just by skipping ahead a little bit. Yeah, let's do that. I like that way better. And then we go back to the beginning of the running footage after this. Which is a lot of me running through leaves because it's fun. <laughs> Take that, leaves. That works really well with the timing as well. I'm going to I'm just going to do it back and forth a few times. Uh, it makes me happy. I hope it makes you happy too. Okay, let's grab this guy. We can actually come back to this. Um, how many times did I do it? Okay, there we go. Oh yeah, that's good stuff. I'm just like trying to skate through it, get, getting the good stuff. Okay, what's this? All right, we're not using that. Okay, let's go like this. Uh, I, there were some there were some older older French guys watching me do this, and they were really not sure about me. Which I'm I'm sure not many of you were uns, unsure about me now too after seeing this. But you know what? You gotta you gotta enjoy your life. I realized that the camera. So this this is a behind the scenes, right? Normally, what I try to do when I set up the phone because you're getting a lot of you're running a lot extra that you're getting no credit for in your app, your running app, because the app is on the phone that you left behind, so it doesn't know. It just thinks you're standing there. Which makes your run times way slower. Makes you look. Anyways, I'm over it. But what I try to do is I try to remember what I, I usually have the angle, like the camera angle in mind, and I run just past it to where I'm going to start. And then I run through the shot, and I usually overshoot by a lot just to be sure, and then come back and get my phone. Um, but in this one, I forgot that I was angled that far to the left. I thought I was angled a little bit more straight on. So I ran, I just, I didn't get it right. You see, normally I get that perfect. Didn't get it right this time. But what we'll do is we'll just start me running from the pole. And it looks like I'm, you know, I'm not going very fast, but at least it looks like I'm really running, which is good. And then what I'm going to do, because that sound on both fronts... interesting because you can't hear that one so then we want to just do a nice cheese the, the, these these cursors are so ridiculous you definitely aren't going to lose them on the screen that's for sure okay and then and then we can cut like little jumps here whoops So distracting to have these giant cursors. And then we can cut to the next one. Got a lot out of that one. Okay, here we go. Oh, it's interesting. I forgot that we I cut all the way to this. This is a set, this is a park that I've never run in before. I don't even it's it's theoretically part of the Petite Censure. But there's no I don't think I ever talked about the fact that there was no um there were no train lines here. Man, I'm slow moving today though really feel like I was not running very fast, which is okay. 
Definitely running a long ways from the camera, though. Do 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 do. Should do the trick ish. I don't know if I made it. Yeah, I didn't make it very far. I realized, again, I didn't realize I didn't make it very far. I was not doing my best today. There we go. That works. Okay. And then, this is the one where I was supposed to be doing a selfie. And then I played with this leaf. I was playing with a lot of leaves today because then I found this branch and I was trying to get this leaf in the shot. And oh, you can see little tiny little bugs crawling. It's kind of fun. See them crawling? Look at them. Look at them go. They're so small. They are so small. Okay, here we go. And we're getting into the talky bit now, which isn't, it's not too bad. 45 seconds is a little long, but. And then I think that'll do. The music seems a little bit loud, but. It's true, I could have gotten an Apple Watch if I'd gotten an iPhone, but and that would be that was like one of the main selling points to be honest, but not not a strong enough selling point by comparison. Okay, actually we can keep this going a little bit longer underneath. Good morning. It seems like it's been keeping most parks open since they were going to. I've never run in this one before, but uh oh, and there's a is that a rabbit? I might actually that's probably just a rat. <laughs> I am in Paris, after all. Uh, good morning. Uh, today, it's going to be like a little bit of a project day slash admin day. I've got some work to do for one of the secret projects we'll be talking about sooner than later. Hopefully the next month or two. I'll just keep teasing it until then, I guess. I'll start talking about it soon. We'll figure that out. But I had a long phone call with Brian and Andrew about that this morning. And then now, uh, yeah, out for a run when I go back. I've got to work on that some today. But also, I have like three small projects that I want to get done in the chateau. Just to make my life one step better. Uh, or actually, it'll make it three steps better as I complete each one. You'll see in a second, but until then, I'm going to keep running. Oh, now the question is... Cool. I didn't know this guy was in the shot. I wasn't sure if he's in the shot when he stopped me. Okay. Other problem is that we got... Quite the noisy background here that's um, visually noisy. It's going to make it kind of hard to see this, maybe, but we can just put this here. And we can say, he did say, excuse me, so we can we can definitely make him sound as polite as he is. Uh, excuse me, my good sir. How about that? That's a little bit over the top. You guys, will, you guys will know that that was not serious when you see it tomorrow. And everyone else will be like, why is that guy really that serious? No, no. Well, he kind of was. He's nice. <laughs> I can't do that. I can't do that. That's ridiculous. Excuse me. It's funny, but it's, um, yeah, it's just a little bit too much. And also, this is still kind of hard to read, isn't it? So one of the tricks we can do for this is we can give it a stroke. Something like, you can't see this because it's on the other screen, but, um, Something, I guess something like this should do the trick. And then we just need to make it, whoa, a little thicker. Let's make it three, something like that. And that'll help it to stand out. So we'll just go. And you can kind of hear me, you can hear me talk to him. Should I just leave that? So here's a question for you. I'm gonna put this. I'm gonna put this to it. I'm gonna put this out to you, to those of you watching at home, uh, you know, or wherever you're watching from. Which should we? Uh, should I even just cut out? Because I'm gonna explain it here in a second, and I'm kind of tempted, honestly, to um, not put subtitles in it and just go like this. Did you hear that guy ask me if I knew where the exit was? Makes me wonder how far this goes. I think I I'm going to do that. I'm going to do no subtitles and just. Okay. 
Did you hear that guy ask me if I knew where the eggs were? And then we're going to do a little overlap. This is called an L cut, if I can remember how to write letters. Did you hear that guy ask me if I knew where the exit was? Makes me wonder how far this goes. I think I just committed myself to running an, un an unknown. Am I'm, gonna, I'm just going to see. Oh, we'll find out. No. How far did I run away? Oh, well, pretty far away. I mean, the wide angle makes it look even farther, but that's that's pretty far. Okay. Oh, this is a this is a, these are nice shots though. That audio is great. I don't want to leave. Put that in underneath. Did you hear that guy ask me if I knew where the exit was? Makes me wonder how far this goes. Let's um put that in just a little bit in that gap there. A little bit of. I don't usually do too much sound engineering like this. I knew where the exit was. Makes me wonder how far this goes. I think I just committed myself. But it's cool. Like I, li I really like that. Really like that. Because especially because I'm not going to use a ton of the actual footage. Probably, because I was going to use that more in the intro. And the sunlight died right when I started filming this log, so it's not really what I wanted anymore. Oh, please tell me that I actually filmed that. Oh, you're kidding me. I put it down. Oh, there I go. Okay, good. I was going to say, you're joking me. You're jashing. Like that. Oh, excuse me. And then we're going to go ahead and leave that a little bit longer. We can use the running towards footage here. I always try to do both. I usually don't use both, like the towards in a way, but sometimes it's fun, like stylistically, to do both. Just depends on the shot. That actually worked. There we go. Oh, hey, my dad's in here. Hey, Dad. Hey, Daddy. Daddy-o. Okay, so that is the end of the running segment, I guess. I was going to talk more about the Petite Saint. Sure, and apparently... Oh, that's right, because I found a spot where I wanted to do it, and then um, weirdos showed it up. I'd say, I would think about people that ruin my shots. I'm like, what a bunch of weirdos ruining my shot. How could they? How could they? How? How could they? Okay, let's do this. Let's see how this goes. Cool. There's some good stuff left in that song that we can use later. A lot of noise there. The first thing is the kettle here. It's uh, got a little bit of a buildup, you know, of calcium. There's a, there's a term for it. Just Hold on. I actually, look, I should. I do need to find this. That was kind of going to be the joke. Let me find, um, fellow. How to clean your fellow gear. And then they had a thing in here. It's kind of a funny, like, if you look at the, um, I like, look at that. <laughs> it's it's a kettle in the shower. It's so cute. Okay, anyways, you can see like, the level of research that I do here. It's uh, kind of shameful. Okay, so calcium carbonate. That's what we needed to know. Just looked it up, calcium lime trade. <laughs> <laughs> All right, there's that. And what we're going to do is make this nice and small because it's a little more sarcastic if it was smaller and a little lighter. Like that. Calcium lime trade. <sighs> Apparently, I, I really do need some more coffee. Anyways, this should be easy enough to clean. I really do need some more coffee. Anyways, this should be easy enough to clean. I thought I would have to boil it with well, water and vinegar, but it's just like they 
just had to soak it, like, at the halfway point. They just had to soak it with, like, like half water, half vinegar. Well, water and vinegar, but it's just, like, like they just had to soak it with, like, half water, half vinegar. It's perfect. That, oh, that's one of the things that I bought yesterday, or the other day when I was at the store. That's one of the things that I bought yesterday, or the other day. That, oh, that's one of the things that I bought yesterday, or the other day when I was at the store. I had, I bought a five gallon, I was at the store, I had, I bought a five gallon, or five gallon, I bought a five liter jug, or five gallon, I yesterday, or the other day when I was at the store, I bought a five liter jug of water. Um, Sometimes it's fun to leave the little, like, flubs, but at some point there's too many flubs, and it goes from being kind of funny to being, like, like encumbering, I don't know. I was gonna say embêtant, which is the French for like encumbered, or it's 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 a good word. To make my coffee with because it should stupidified. Because we've seen how hard my water is; it, it happens really quickly. But then we've got this uh, white vinegar that we should be able to use, you know, to help clean it up. Which is always counterintuitive because I always think if you're gonna use that, isn't it gonna stink later? But no, turns out it doesn't doesn't work that way. What have I decided to do here is the question. That's always the question from here. I don't really remember what I... Oh, yeah. So let's get... We can get a couple shots of this and put it above. That looks nasty. Nasty wasty. Unlink this guy. But da, 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 da. A water and vinegar, but it's just like... They just said to soak it with like half coffee. Anyways, this should be easy enough to clean. I thought I would have to boil it with well, water and vinegar, but it's just like... They just said to soak it with like... See if we get a, we got, I had another, another shot like that, but not as clear as the day I bought it. Okay, there we go. And get rid of that first mistake. Get rid of this. Get rid of that. Definitely. Turns out it doesn't, doesn't work that way. And then we're going to over, overlay that. It doesn't, doesn't work that way. Definitely not as clear as the day I got it. Okay, so end that there. Now, we go to the, we're going to do a little one, two, like a spoop, spoop. Like that. It's so weird to do this above my other screen. Come on, get to it, buddy. There we go. That's what we want. I'll we'll just cut like that. Okay, we can cut that down here in a second. Got it. Okay, let's make this faster. What's that noise? Okay, I guess that'll do. Something like that. Quick, quick, wing, bing, bing, bang, boom. Okay, while that is uh, soaking, we said for 30 minutes on... Okay, while that is uh, soaking, we said for 30 minutes on the, the Bello website. This guy's the next thing. For one, I need to get um, the rack. So I've got... Uh, let's see. I've got my... bag. I've got... Uh, you can do another one of those little. I've got my awesome weatherproof saddlebag here. That uh, was how I managed to get all this stuff back. But it has inside of it a couple of accessories that need to be added. The so shoulder strap is not one of them. The main one is this. The not one of them. Not one of them. The main one is this guy right here, which I'm kind of scared of though, now that I just opened like that. This is so that I can attach the saddlebag to the side of the This is so I can attach the saddlebag to the side of the bike. This is so doop doop double down layer. I'm oh yeah. Wait, what? What's oh <laughs> yeah, my dad's definitely beating me on the mileage. I assume he's beating me already this month too, but you never know. I could actually be ahead because he he does have snow, so that could be working in my favor. 
That could be working in my favor. This is so I can attach the saddlebag to the side of the bike. So that's one thing that needs to go in the back of the bike. Which I would have had like them do at the official office, whatever, but COVID. Uh, bike clock also needs to be attached to the bike. And what's this? Oh, the toolbox. That doesn't need to be attached. Ooh, look at that. There's a special pouch in here. I didn't know that. This thing's not only like supposedly weatherproof, but it has a little pouch in here. Just woke the bike up. Has a little pouch in here uh, for little things, I guess, that you can put in and not worry about uh, getting lost in the bottom. So that, that that's project number two. Do 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 do. Should be jumping into the shower here. Magic movie, magic. He is just suddenly in the shower. Who knew that such things were possible? <laughs> That's a good one. I like that. That's a very good impression, uh, Mystery Man. Okay. shower thingy, which I, you know, I've, I've been procrastinating on for a long time. Uh, I don't entirely know why I've been procrastinating on it, because it's annoying, but it's one of those things you only think about when you get in the shower, and usually that's at like midnight or something, and you're like, wow, I need, I need to remember to do something about this, and then you never do. At least I don't do. But today, this guy... Is going in the shower. This guy is going in the shower. Does it fit in here? No, it doesn't. Well, it's not compatible with the mounting that I have in here already, but you know what? That's just tough. A bit of bing, bada boom, bada boom. Sorry, there's a lot of silence on my end as I'm focusing on this. I'm also just like, <sighs> kind of tired, to be honest. So, with no further ado, I suppose we should be productive. I kind of messed with the lights and stuff for a while because I was not wanting. I was still wanting to procrastinate and not do this stuff. And I guess we can. Just messing with the lights now. Huh? Productive. Huh? Just messing with the lights now. Huh? That make a difference. There we go. So with no further ado. Uh, let's 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 be productive, I guess. Ha 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 Or just stand here. There's a, there's like a little knob. On. Uh, it's kind of cool because you can see the inner workings. It, okay. It is kind of cool because you can see the inner workings. Okay. It's kind of cool because you can see the design does not appeal to me that much. That's okay. Oh, well. God, I'm so, I was so, I don't know what was wrong with me this morning. The design does not appeal to me that much. That's so, no further so we're just going to swap this around a little bit and it'll make some more sense. see the inner workings because of the poop plastic but honestly the design does not appeal to me that much I'm uh, just messing with the lights now uh, that make a difference there we go so with no further ado uh, I'll just cut it there <laughs> alright moving on oh my gosh this is seven this is like an eight minute clip no oh. <laughs> uh, am I not? I'm not remembering everything clearly enough to know what the heck is going on. Okay, let's try. Uh, we'll just do this by sound to start, and also we got to drop this guy way the heck out because we're definitely not using it anytime soon. It's shower head time, indeed. Somebody's. It's got to happen sometime. Found it there. Thankfully, the guys that put up my. Uh, oh wait, can I just do this by hand? Oh wow! I was gonna say, <laughs> I was gonna say, thankfully the guys who uh, installed my TV left this behind. I did try to contact them. I, I sent them emails. I even called the company that they that sent them. They never came back for it. But I was thinking this whole time I was gonna need to use these, but. Uh, Looks like I can just 
fucking gross. That was gross. You that. Go figure the little washer. Complete. Where's that box? Yeah, it's all wet. Yeah, it's all wet. Oh, right. Uh, <laughs> work with me, keyboard. All right, let's see. The wrench goes swing, slack, clickety clack. Oh my gosh, these ginormous icons are just too much. Came with extra in came with extra Whoops. Came with extra in came with extra balls. Extra There we go. It came with extra balls. Interesting. And tape. What is this? Instructions inside. Their instructions inside. Uh, uh, uh. Oh, it's in English. Very tiny, tiny font. Got that there. Find whatever comes next after I finish. Just left this thing. No wonder I ran out of space on my heart or on my memory card today. Think man. What is this? Whoops! 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 Hitting too many buttons at once. Here we go. WD forty would do the trick. That is interesting. I don't know. If they sell WD-40 here. What's what the equivalent? Is what is the equivalent? Oh, no, oh, there's extra washers. Oh, there's like a filter in this guy. What? Wait, what? Is there one in here? Oh, did this pop out? What's going on? This is when I might need the... This is when I might need the... Something got left behind. Behind. Oh, oh, oh. Nasty. Does this belong? Is this like. I don't think this is an old system. Oh no, don't go down the. Oh, there's a spring involved. Okay, that's enough of that, I think. Almost lost that down the drain. Like a leak? Prevention? I'm taking it out for now because I don't think it's compatible with this. Oh, there's a spring involved. I'm taking it out for now because I don't think it's compatible with this guy. Oh no, please tell me you actually fit. There we go. Ew, water. Well, that's what was kind of lod lod lodged up in there. I hope that I okay. did that tight enough. I think I did. If there's a washer in this guy, then I know I did that right. Oh, there is. Okay. Wait, do I want to have a washer and a filter? Nope. Okay. I feel like I might. There's a lot of figuring stuff out in real time here, which is grand. I know I did that right. Oh, there is. This is even remotely interesting, this part. Because it's got, it has both. It came with the washer that has. Meh, 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 meh. Fold. 
old Parisian piping. All right, now to see if it actually works and hopefully not ruin my camera in the process. That guy's kind of nasty. Also, this is it before I wash it away because apparently that's what I need to do. That's the stuff that like came out of the, the old, when I pulled that thing out, it had captured all that inside, so that's great. All right, let's see if this works. Oh gosh, that is a lot of pressure. Wow, whoa, how, wow. Okay, I'm impressed. Like, the, the pressurization in here is actually, that's pretty crazy. I should have shown you what the tube looked like without it. Cause that's nothing. Whoa, okay. Whatever they did to make this thing a pressure hound, it's a working. Let's try that switch flip. Wow, I'm impressed. I am really impressed. I am, I am really impressed. That is a kick. Holy smokes. Okay. Project three complete. Okay. All right, I redid that for. Here we go. So we'll do a little more movie magic for you here. Okay. Project three. So we got to write the word complete, uh, not complete, complete. We can do a little bit of the, hold on. Oh, hold on. I, I know, I know. I think I can make this so worth everyone's while. One uno momento. We'll line this up with the, the shower here. I'm going to move that over. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to draw a wee mask. It's got to be a mask around the text like so. And the mask is going to match with my hand like so. And steadily wipe away. It's a wipe effect, but custom made to fit the instance in which we are. Mask path, yes. And I want to increase the feather about to there. All right. Something like that. Okay. The mask. A boop. Let me swipe that over. A boop, but we want to do this the other way, so we want this to be inverted. A boop, like so. Whoops, keep that up. A boop. So it looks like it's coming out of my palm a little bit is the kind of the goal here. It doesn't have to be perfect, which is good because it won't be. Whoops, didn't need that. Starting to the angle is changing as my hand swipes. But I think something like this is just fine. We don't need to do too much there. Oh, please tell me that this is actually animating. We're about to find out. Those are one of the worst moments when you're like, oh, I did all that work, and then Complete. there you go. And then it didn't actually do what it's supposed to do. <laughs> Okay, cool. We're going to leave that there. Ba -dum -bum -bum. Oh, that's what I was going to do. I was going to wash it away. Right, because that's clever. <laughs> so let's try it. Easiest way to do this is to, I guess we, we um, make a second path, a second mask like this, and this one, um, is it going to work? Uh, inverted. Is it? What is it doing? Interesting. Normally that would um work just fine. So we're gonna cut this here. We're gonna take this guy, undo everything we did with him on the animation front, move him here, and then oh, let's do this. Let's make this work with the water. This is way too much. Normally I wouldn't do all this, but I was just having fun with the shower and actually what we could do it's a good point because i do if i'm gonna have quote unquote fun with this we need to make it a little bit more than just so we'll go mass path here and then go down so what we're gonna do is we're going to make this guy come out here this guy come out here like that and then on the next one we'll have this guy go like that, and this guy go like this. A little bit more like that, so it looks like it's washing it away. 
And then this guy come down, and this guy come down. This is going to look really stupid, potentially. Ah, we're going to give it... Oh, come on. Okay, we're going to... Then, where are we at? This one's really not helpful. Let's zoom in here. Thank you. Okay, so... Okay, so then this, you can see the water is down here more. I'll do this. Because this is ridiculous. What am I doing? I don't even know what I'm doing right now. Just kind of silly. Frame by frame animating this. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. What an what a absolute goober. This is going to look so bad. Nope, stop that. I want this guy to come up and this guy to go. Stop it. Down. And this guy to go up more. Oh, I did not mean to add one there. Nope. Oh. Whoops. I don't want that. Okay, hold on. Yep, I want that. And then, so here is where we want this to go all the way up. I'm going to try this, and it might just completely backfire. And then this guy, we're going to, yep, bring, wait, oh, stop moving like that. Like that. And I think, let's see how this looks. Complete. Oh, that actually worked. <laughs> okay. Ah, oh, thank goodness, because that was a lot of, that was a lot of silly, silliness, but it actually worked out. Complete. Okay, cool. Well, there we go. Okay, moving on. I think I was partially intimidated. I think I was partially intimidated by the, um, like the plumbing element. Like, I'm not element. Like, I'm not so sure that I trusted myself to, I'm, it's not that hard, but for whatever reason, I was a little bit nervous. The other side was that I knew I was going to have to take off my socks, otherwise they were going to get wet. And there's something just about wet socks that just makes me not want to do anything with any project, like ever. Wet socks are the worst. Okay, moving on. Where are we at? Good transition. Uh, and then I, I um, got all schmancy and did a little swing cut here with the. What we can do here too is, I think, this. Nope. I lied. What we need to do is go like this. That worked. Not only do I want to get that worked. I'm jack of all trades, my hair. Stuff like that. So, not only do I want to get the saddlebag on this guy, but when I'm done putting it together, I'm going to park it downstairs because I'm fortunate enough to have access to the garage, and I never thought I'd actually park a vehicle down there, but it makes perfect sense to do so, especially because, like, it's just direct access to the street, and then I don't have to carry it up into the stairs. Like, now that I have the electric motor to carry me up the ramp, what have I been thinking? Yo, yeah, Trey, what have you been thinking? Oh, I had, oh no, Dixie, this is for you. I had this all lined up and I, that we're ready. Project three, complete. I think I was part. <laughs> uh, that's what I was going to do earlier and I didn't do it because I suck. Okay. I just completely forgot I was going to do it. All right, so let's do a quick 
This gets confusing as well because there are no instructions. You just got to figure it out, which I figured it out. And I looked at some old instructions on a different bike and it worked. Just drink more beer. It will make more sense. That's a fair call. That is a fair call. Thanks, noob. Appreciate that. You know it. That's a Twitch. I'm responding to the super noob over on Twitch. For those of you that are like, what the heck? It was here. I think that's going to work. I'm not missing anything else, am I? What am I? Okay, we can get that. Get some doomy doomy doom doom dongs with this. What is this guy? There you go. I actually kind of want that too. Let's put this here. What is this guy? Go. Also, what did I just miss? Something happened. I just missed something. Hold on. It'll tell me in this window. Whoa, thanks, Swoob. Yanni. Thanks, Yanni, with the Swoob. Oh, I see that. Appreciate it. Ah. Mm. The sound effects are on my soundboard over here. That's how I get things like this. And I can just pipe that straight into the live stream. It's pretty fantastic. It's the That's the benefit of having a podcasting soundboard, which is super overkill for what I'm doing here. Where does this guy go? Dun -dun 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 -dun. Whoops. Whoops. He was here, and these guys go. So here, down where the mud guard is, does not coexist. Down where the mud guard is, does not coexist. It has to coexist with the mud guard. Could be argued that I occasionally figure things mud out. Guard. Something like that. <laughs> Boy, it's a good thing this wasn't. This isn't a, a piece of like, like vital safety equipment. That's for sure. Oh, thanks, Eddie. Appreciate that. Okay, there's a little bit of that action. We could probably put some music to this because we've gone music free for a lot of this, and that's not. There's nothing wrong with that, but. We're going to do some music. Oh, somebody changed the colors with their super chats. Who knows which color that was? I was I it's green now. A schmancy. A schmancy. Okay, let's see about this. Whoop. Thanks, mystery man. Bike and haul action. moving here we go i don't know man i think getting up earlier i've been getting up a lot earlier since we've been in lockdown it definitely makes a difference on my uh late night longevity for sure i feel i feel myself falling apart let's do also like that and then i changed the camera angle because i'm not a total Goober. Oh boy, I hope it's one of these guys. Boy, do I, because they didn't come with any tools. This, I think we're getting into the part that makes that'll move things along really quickly with the music here too. Ooh, 
Do, 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 do. Lefty, loosey, righty, tighty. Indeed. Unless you're putting on uh, bike pedals, in which case one of them's always going to be backwards. There we go. This one didn't go in flush the same way the other one did, and I'm not sure why. I'm going to have to look into that. This is such a pain in the butt, though, because I can only do just like a quarter turn at a time. So we're just going to do it. We'll definitely do a spinny time lapse of this guy. Hopefully it isn't too annoying with all the hand flashing going on in there. Uh, and then this guy will get back to this. Success. Oh, you know what? That's something that we can grab right here maybe let's see I want the ding. We're not there yet. Oh, we actually, we have, because I have on this guy as well, I think. Is it the same one? No. So we have a couple more. That's right. We have a couple more screw shots up here. Perfect. Perfect. Okay, so this this will make it. Those ones are a little bit disconcerting because they don't have to go straight in. They're like, it's a little bit of an one that can do it at an angle. And it's, yeah, RIP bike. Oh, no. Oh, yeah, an Ikea bike. Got it. I was like, what, 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 what? Did my bike just die? Did my bike just die? I am streaming on Twitch as well. Yes, I'm streaming on both. I'm a streaming on everything right now. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Glug, glug, glug. I'm really, I'm really trying to milk this uh, screw footage. That sounds dirty. See if we can. There it is. There it is. Finally made it. Audio gain. I mean not. <clears throat> I mean speed duration. That's what I mean. Wait, hey, get in there. Gosh, these ginormous I these ginormous cursors there we go so we got some speedy screw footage and this is unfortunately out of focus because i had it in manual focus but this this uh saddlebag is super cool Let's just go ahead and take the music out for a second and see if it works better without it. We're going to go with these guys. How do you gain plus four?
Sorry, just uh, really hon trying to hone in on this, make it feel a little bit faster. It is. It's cool. Uh, did I get two? No, I only got one of the saddlebags. Um, giggity. Look at them ankles. Um, yeah, no, I only ended up getting one. Oh, it stinks that this shot's out of focus. It's not too bad. I guess I got kind of in focus, which is all right in the end. It doesn't look too bad, actually. It's, about, it's actually in focus right about the right spot, which is kind of crazy. Oh, no, it's not. Yeah, it's just... I think we would actually want to be about here. As if as ah. There we go. As if everything about this as if wow, that's quite the violent jostle there. so many jokes that could be made about this. I'm just going to put the lock on. Dirty. This is, I think this is uh, out of focus. This lock is so monstrous. It's crazy. I think I make a comment or three about it, but. This, this thing is so heavy. It's a good thing I'm not going to be turning my bike up and down those stairs all the time. Right there. Uh, da, da, da. Actually, what we can do here, too, is we can do a little constant gain, which will help blend this together a little bit better. Gone. This thing is so heavy. It's a good thing I'm not going to be turning my bike up and down those stairs all the time. Right there. Okay, so I want to cut that there, but this is a really long clip again. Whoops. Oh, shoot, 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 shoot. Come on. Don't do that. Ah, come on. Ah, there it is. Come here. Come here. Yeah, there we go. Always really fun when uh, you accidentally make everything way too big. And let's just let's just make this real snap, real snappy because I also put it on upside down the first time, so that's great. Actually, I guess it doesn't matter. You can put it on whichever direction you want, but and I have a reverse angle of this, so we can just we can, that gives us the ability to do both, which is kind of cool. So let's do that. Yeah, here we are. Something like that. Oh boy, this is real slow. That's not, that's, it can't work that way against this guy, so we gotta push this. Oh, because I'm doing it upside down, that's why. So we can get this guy. Where's the rotation? to the zippy bit here. Do, 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 do. <laughs> yeah, you won't get banned, but I don't know if that shows respect. You could explain the theory of how spamming the chat shows respect, though. I guess I suppose that, that could be an interesting, that could be an interesting electronic philosophical debate. Uh, <laughs> yeah, Yanni has spoken. That's why Yanni has the power. Okay, we need the music again, I think. Cause this is just... Maybe I'm just, like, not feeling it for sure, but... 
Oh, you do it from here at least. Oh, because I'm doing it upside down, that's why. Yeah, this is better. Where's the actual? There it is. I guess, I guess that's it. thing is so monstrous it's like it is such a beast i guess this is like abus the company rates this 15 out of 15 for the like the, this is their best this is as as locky as their locks get apparently so cool it's so, it is so heavy though. It's crazy how heavy it is. What am I doing? Oh, I'm just shoving it back in. It's kind of a cool angle. The lighting is kind of fun today. Except this part might be just too dark to see literally anything. A lot of thumbs ups here too. It's too much. Nobody wants to that many thumbs ups. Okay, here we go. Just a little bit of talk in here. The Uber lock with all the lockiness. All the lockiness, none of the thieviness. And like that? Yep, see that's too many. It's just silly. Let's just do this. And then we go all the way up. And like, oh, it's all the way here. Ready to ride in like two months. There we go. And then where are we at? Whoops. Just checking in on our vinegar. Just checking in on our vinegar water here, and it has worked like a charm. Look at that mirrored bottom. Delightful. It's crazy. Look at how much nicer that looks. That's so much better. Oh, you can see some of it floating in the water there. Let's get rid of this. Gold Gold money. It's seriously very warpy, very warped, very warped mirror look on the bottom there. It's seriously very, very warped. It's seriously very warped mirror look on the bottom there. Voila! Look at that. What happens to the wheel? The wheel still gets used. The wheel is for different purposes. These are all different purposes things. I don't know why everybody's so upset with like my. Uh, not, not that you're upset, but there are a lot of people that are like, oh, well, you're never going to ride the wheel now. I was like, of course I'll ride the wheel. The wheel is not, the wheel is not a commuting device. You don't want to ride the wheel for more than like, you know, like 15 minutes at a time, really. I've, I've ridden it for longer, obviously, but you have to take breaks and you're going all the way across town. It also doesn't go that fast. Like it caps out at like 20 kilometers an hour. The bike goes way faster than that. If the wheel even goes that fast. And uh, it still counts as exercise. Like it's still exercise. The thing is the wheel is good for filming and the bike is good for commuting. And uh, then I don't have to get in the metro anymore if I have the bike, which is great. But it's funny because I feel like a lot of people are like, just, yeah, like, don't worry. The wheel will still get used. The wheel will still get used. It's still going to get some love. But it's been getting less love anyways because of the 88, the style of it's been. I tried picking those little black 
less um, wheel friendly anyways. Cause the, but I did use it for one of them and it, it didn't work very well. So the bike, the electronic motor caps out at 25 kilometers an hour. Cause that's what, um, that is what the EU law requires. Um, but I got it up to 28 or whatever. That's just as fast as the electronic motor will take you, but then you can push it past that. So I think I got it to 28 or 29 kilometers an hour when I rode it home the other day. I tried picking those little black things up and they streaked. It turns out it was a tiny little charcoal filter. Who knew? I feel better about taking it out now though. Ba -doo -ba -doo. Yeah, it's chores times. Is it? Are these chores? There's some of them are chores. I guess cleaning stuff is chores. up andrea in melbourne do, 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 do. let's do this there we go and this should take us back down to that fun garage footage Whoop. We'll just kind of put that in as it is. And I think I'll put it right here. I think that should time it right. One, 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 one. Nope, not there. I lied. Voila. The kitchen madness back here. So I had to do this multiple times because that lady ruined my shot. Let's do this one. That'll work, I guess. It's not really what I wanted. Oh, here we go. That's the one I... Eh, they're all, they're all kind of okay. I also rode straight into this other slot. There's that lady who I surprised who ruined that shot. She ruined another shot earlier. She's just ruining shots. What's she doing walking through the garage? That's suspicious. Yay, that's about as much bike riding as I'm going to get to do in, for the foreseeable future. Huh? Oh, sorry. I can't, I don't, I can't change the, the uh, t I can change the title later. I wish it said Sanity 2. I didn't know that. I had to redo multiple things to try and get this up live. And mistakes happen. This bike is the best thing ever. It's so big. So this bike is the best thing ever. It's so big. So I don't really need a mask on inside, I suppose. The sound bag is great. I was able to put my. I'll show you. You have missed a lot, Virginie, but that's okay. It'll all be available. Well, on Twitch, it'll be available only for like a week, but on YouTube, it'll be available forever.
incorrect. Change that up. Now you can do that. Uh, matching sounds. Come on. I hate these giant I curse or whatever. Okay, I'm just gonna I'm gonna redo this guy to like there and see if that works. There he goes. <coughs> Excuse me. <laughs> Excuse me, we're gonna just dry throat for a second. Thought I was gonna cough a little bit more there than I did. There she goes again. What is she doing? She's so suspicious. And I scared her that time too. Ow. Suspicious. I guess we'll put on some more music from where it closes. Okay, there's that guy and then back upstairs we go actually i wasn't gonna i was gonna do just a sheer sound for this let's see how this works i feel very distracted go there we go <laughs> uh let's extend that out a little bit here to <laughs> uh i shouldn't be allowed near a camera wow this is a long one today this is turning into way longer than i thought it was going to be the sitting and talking. Uh, the, yeah, the, the bike actually has a SIM card in it. It has its own tracking system. So it's on GPS, basically. So it's all built in, which is great. Thanks there, Charhu, for some champs. Those, getting those cheers in there. She probably is the imposter cam cam. You're totally right. Makes total sense. little sit down and you know coffee moment i have a lot of work still to do today <laughs> it's funny because with the whole you know confinement thing one of the things i have and this is going to be satisfying i have a project journal and i get to cross off a few things on my list i was going to make it look prettier for camera but we'll see uh so let's see shower head replacement check then move rack installation check then move parking Although I guess, you know, then move bike lock installation. I'm going to add that to the bottom here. Then move lock install. Check. It's just additionally, it's just, it's just more satisfying to be able to check off more things. That's basically all that's about. I'm making some pretty good headway here. There are a couple of these that are definitely, there's one 
I got to get on top of my receipts and the finances stuff. It's very high priority. Uh, but that's nice because what, what I've managed to accomplish here today is I've made my shower less annoying. And holy cow, the shower pressure. I dumped some coffee drains. So I've got dumped some coffee grounds down the drain. So I've got the shower pressure. I dumped some coffee grounds down the pressure. I got dumped some coffee grounds down the the drain. Uh, What's up, Ami, Ami Bunny? Cheers in Twitch. They're like, they're kind of, it's kind of like Super Chat, but it's, uh, you know, with bits instead. <laughs> pressure, I got dumped some coffee grounds down the drain uh, in the shower just to keep cleaning it. For those of you that are concerned about the stink, I'm pretty sure I've beaten it, uh, mostly with coffee grounds. Mostly with coffee grounds. Actually, so since we don't have much in the way of live chat, I feel like... This guy is kind of, I don't know, th with the viewer count hanging out on top of my head, it's kind of annoying. Let's just put this up there. That looks a little bit nicer, doesn't it? Look, we're, we're, we're making improvements and modifying things as we go. Who knew? Who knew? Grounds, mostly with coffee grounds. And um, with, I did do one keep cleaning it. For those of you that are concerned about the stink, I'm pretty sure I've beaten it. Uh, mostly with beaten it. Uh, mostly with coffee grounds. And um, with, I did do one run of the D block D stink stuff that I still had left over but we'll find out I haven't done like a full fledged the full force shower like a like full on one for a while because I've been trying to like ease my way back into it tonight's the night I'm going to give it a try I'm going to do a full on yeah full like full pressured shower and we'll see if it causes any stink to, to emanate but I think I might have beaten it purely with the power of coffee and if that doesn't if that doesn't give you a reason to love coffee even more than you may have already loved coffee I don't know what will but that feels pretty good to get that done. I, it's also a good way of procrastinating from other work that I absolutely should be doing right now. Well, that is a much better answer than my answer, Yanni. I absolutely should be doing right now, and I will get to immediately. Um, how, how, like, how, how, like, how is it going for you so far if you're in France and in lockdown? Obviously, obviously different parts of the world are going into lockdown again. Spain was in lockdown, I think, before us. The UK just announced one this weekend. It's all it's all a mess. And not that there's anything particularly stressful going on today when you're watching this, tomorrow as I'm recording it. Not that not that there's anything that not that not that there's anything that might be bothering anybody today. Hoping to get you outside of that for a minute, but the project definitely helped. And it's good because I feel like I'm already hitting a routine. I'm gonna run pretty much every every day because I really feel like it makes a huge difference for my mental health getting up being active getting my bike out of there and downstairs clears up a lot of space and also i think it's just generally going to be more convenient as long as i make sure to get the engine on because i was riding it while it was in its off off state and uh, it doesn't shift gears as quickly when it's in its off state because it has an automatic gear shifter in case you missed that part earlier and uh yeah you got to work really hard to get up that ramp without the electric motor running um we'll get that figured out but yeah having my coffee mug but yeah having my coffee but yeah, having my coffee kettle cleaned out, the shower working, and the van move fully assembled finally, and, and parked in its route, the shower working, and the van move fully. Ah, that's what I was like, something, I was missing something, it's the full, the, I'm missing the full fully. Move fully assembled finally, and parked in sort its of. appropriate parking space is a great combination. And I think I'm going to, so theoretically, I've seen people riding their bikes around. And I know that I can uh, go into town for work, which I'm going to have to do this week anyways because I have to get Kate mailing stuff for patrons. And hey there, so patrons. That's accessible. I know a lot of people that are, are coming into town or uh, moving around town for work as necessary. Um, so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to try and do that. So we, we will get one bike ride in at least, and hopefully we won't get fined for, for doing it. For doing it. And that'll be delightfully satisfying, hopefully. But, um, yeah. Otherwise, I'm going to try and get into a good routine of uh, still making some of these videos, even if my daily vlogs are going to go back to being a little bit shorter than they used to be or a little bit less frequent, uh, maybe not every day, every day. Um, I'll keep making these. I'm going to exercise in the morning. I've got projects like this to get through. I've got a lot of stuff to keep me kind of up and moving and, and going. And uh, and that's really that's really, really the key, I think, to keep staying sane over the next few months. The nice thing is that I'm, I'm in a much better headspace going into this one than I was last time. Going into the last one, I was I was already on the verge of that was quite the flash. Last time, going into the last one, I was weird. I was already on the verge of burning out again. I was feeling really overextended, exhausted. Um, you know, I was coming out of 
I mean, I was a ways out from the breakup, but like I'd just come back from a trip to America uh, that was that was way too fast and geared towards her s- schedule instead of my schedule, and uh, and was also mildly it's, it's a little bit depressing to have made plans with somebody to like meet family and do that whole nine yards and then not do it. Granted, it was of my own choosing, so I'm not asking for any pity on this, but it was it was exhausting in its own way. Also, just found out there's some guys that are going to be doing construction two doors down. Of course, they're going to start doing construction while. I'm stuck here. It's going to be great. Oh man, this is going to Oh man, this is going to suck. I can hear them. I can Oh man, this is going to suck. I can hear them. They're just they're loud j- just opening the door. Like But aside from the little things that are really annoying along the way. There was a nice I have a neighbor that brought me food the other day. I just met her a couple days ago. And she brought me food, so that was nice. And I really do feel like going into this one, I don't know, I feel better prepared. I feel um, not excited is the wrong way. I f- doopy 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 doop. Oh, yeah, I don't get a whole lot of sleep, Jill. I get more now, though. I'm making more of a, I'm making it more of a priority, trying to. I feel not excited is the wrong word, but I feel like I have, important. I've got a game plan. You know, I know that I'm going to go into this and I'm going to be okay and I'm going to make it through it. Better than the last time, because even though we're not certain how long this one's going to last, I think we know for sure that it's going to last longer than they're initially saying. And we have some of the patterns and the stuff to look back on to help us move forward through this next experience. So if anything, I feel like I've got to capitalize on this time just to make sure that I tie up some loose ends, get some stuff done, make some uh, advances on projects that I never get done because I'm making videos. And since video making is much reduced right now, and since my video making capacity is significantly reduced right now, that Making's much reduced. Whoopsies. What? And since my video making capacity is significantly reduced right now, that actually opens up a great opportunity just to get caught up on a lot of little things that otherwise wouldn't get done. And it always feels really good to have those done and behind you. Um, And so in that way, it actually makes me feel kind of excited uh, just to get stuff off my list, like taxes. I'm not excited about taxes, but I'm so excited that I get to do my taxes. So yeah, so yeah, there you go. So yeah, there you go. A little bit of a, a little bit of a project list checked off. I'm gonna add more to it because I, I know I keep thinking of great things to do. Even little things like cleaning. You can hear them closing the, the doors and stuff in the background. It's so bad. I hope they aren't in here forever. There's so much construction going on in these apartments right now. It's no like great. No stuff. good. No good. No bueno. And it's kind of silly to call it projects. It's more like a honeydew list, but. Since I am my own honey, Gilly's not going to give me anything to do because Gilly's just always perpetually silent. Actually, that's something that I was going to get a Gilly shot for that. As I was, this is, might be a little bit dark in here. Hold on. I'm going to, you're going to see me film because I forgot to do it <clears throat> in the moment. Oh, whoops. I need some more light. That's all I needed. Gilly footage complete. Just gotta grab this off the camera. Do I have to file taxes? Uh, yeah, of course. Uh, unfortunately, America is one of only two countries that I'm aware of. In the, I don't remember what the other one is, and I, I'm sure we could look it up. But it's one of only a few countries, let's say that, just to be safe, in the world that require its citizens to pay taxes no matter where they are and no matter where they live and no matter where they earn their money. Everywhere else is like, oh, you live in that country? Cool, pay them taxes because you're using their roads and stuff. Not America. America's like, oh, you live over there? Cool, you still need to pay us. It's like, oh, gosh, darn it. I think I'm out of beer. I have to go. I'm almost out of beer. That's the last. Anywho, I'm a good tax paying citizen. So, um, you know, I'm paying my taxes. Come on in there, Gilly footage. There's a little Easter egg for you. You can see me in the corner right there. There's the stream in the corner for just a second. 
I'm gonna put this gilly footage in over here. She can talk. I mean, this interview because Gilly's just always perpetually silent. She can talk. I bet you she can talk. She's just holding out. But anyways, uh, yeah, I'll keep after it, and I'll let you know how it goes, and I'll keep you apprised as to all of these little projects and more. And there's a lot of fun stuff coming. Thanks to everybody in the Discord server who gave me some uh, ideas of things you'd like to see. If you'd like to join the Discord server, I'll put another link below. I'm going to be more active there, especially as I'm doing streaming and so forth. Definitely do, do that. To come and chat with uh, people who enjoy everything that you, whatever it is that you're enjoying about this right now. It's a spot you can show up and do that uh, as, well, as well as participate in some fun. So we could do the Discord overlay here because I need to do, or no, that was Twitch. Oh, shoot. Never mind. Enjoying about this right now. It's a spot you can show up and do that uh, as well as participate in some fun game stuff that's coming up. And I'll talk more about that here in the coming days. But for now, I am going to go back to actual sit down at the computer and work work. But I have coffee and uh, we'll go from there. And I'm going to try really hard not to be super annoyed by these guys shouting and closing and slamming doors in the hallway. No promises there, though. I'm probably going to be at least a little bit annoyed. Anyways, I'll see you tomorrow. Oh, and thanks to today's patron producer. This is another thing. This is, I got to sit at the computer to get ca uh, caught up on all of this, but... Thanks to Daniela D, my most recent. Ah, oh, 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 Get to use this guy again finally because I found it on Dropbox. It was backed up after all. Huzzah, huzzah, thanks. What was the name that I just said? Thanks to Daniela D, my most Daniela. I'm going to look on Patreon right now to make sure I'm spelling that correctly. Patreon on my lower screen where you can't see it, but it exists. Oh, there she is, Daniela, D-A, Dan, yell, uh, pretty straightforward, let's see. Thanks, Daniela, wee-oo, wee -oo. I think 50 does it, here, and we will make this guy, Demi, put it here, make sure this is the end of the animation, so we line this up correctly and we'll get our i think it's tracking i know i always forget if it's tracking or kerning and we'll go like that and that makes the animation look nice and smooth usually nope not that way though a little early we make this last a little longer D, my most a little longer D, my most recent patron as of this recording about two hours ago Thanks, Daniela. I really appreciate it. It's really good to have you on board, and thanks to all my patrons, as always, for keeping me sane. And honestly, that's a huge part of the reason that I am emotionally relatively sound right now is uh, is knowing that uh, it's going to be okay. Like, I'm going to be able to pay my bills and eat and focus on making more stuff like this. Sorry, I accidentally touched my screen, and it's a touch screen, and now it thinks I'm trying to save Patreon, which I'm not. Thank you. There we go. This for you to enjoy, and hopefully... Uh, we all get through this together, however long that takes. Anywho, I'll see you bright and early tomorrow morning for maybe more projects. Who knows? My shower works, so at least I'll smell good. So then I need to do my little music by Diala. Pretty sure it's today. We can double check that in the project bin, but I'm pretty sure that's correct. Just make that something like that. Go like this. Go like a this. Drag this back to about the 22nd, the pre-22nd mark, which I guess is going to be about here-ish. And then fade it in on this side, like so. And then we found ourselves at a position where we're going to do the polish. Now, for those of you that have never seen this before, I've been around for a live edit before, which is probably some of you, maybe none of them. How touching the touch screen. Got to be careful with the touching touch screen. Um... What are you guys talking about with trees and forests and stuff? Uh, it's not weird, Jill. Thanks for reading my book multiple times. That's very nice of you. Unless you're Apple, they don't pay. I don't know what you guys are talking about. The IRS and Gilly and... Oh, yeah. So the nice thing is with um, the taxes, if that's what you guys are talking about. Um, basically, uh, there is an exemption. So you don't have to pay for the first like hundred and some like hundred and two, hundred three thousand dollars of income. So you don't get double taxed until you're earning more than that. So I actually don't get taxed because I live abroad permanently. That is how I get away with not 
paying taxes in the United States right now, but I still have to declare my taxes. So you're still filing everything. Um, you just get to say, hey, I'm not making that much money, so you can't take any of it. And then they're like, okay, this time. And that's the way that that works right now. So I still have to declare it, but I don't have to pay, which is is good. Oh, who's the OG in here for who's been around the longest? That's a good question. Um, I don't know. Yanni has been around forever. Um, I don't know when Mystery Man found me or Dixie. But they've been around for a long time. DJ's been around for a long time. There's a number of people in here. that Those guys have been... What I've seen in the comments so far, those are the, I think, the oldest school. Paul claims that he has been around since b before I started daily vlogging. I haven't seen Paul in here in a while, though. Uh, so that's super OG. And if Slush or Swirl comes in here, he's the he is the OG for sure. Um, but I don't think he's in right now. But if you guys see Slush slash Swirl slash Wayne, uh, he's been he's been around since he was he was reading my fiction way back in the day, um, like ten years ago. So I think that might be the OG cake. But for tonight, in the comments, I think I think uh, oh you don't fail oh fall okay good I was gonna say that's not a fail. So Yanni's the OG today. OG Yanni, hold on, we can uh, we can make a thing for that. Wait, watch this. Then we're gonna do the polish, um, which I'll talk about more in a second. But first, I gotta go. Not this. Here we go. Wait, just wait for it. Hold on. Here it comes. And it's going to happen. Boom. Look at that. That's huge. There you go. There it is. Tonight's OG viewer is Yanni from Finland. Shazam. Okay. There's some good there's some good OG times. Oh yeah, that's pretty early there. Wait, but you okay, hold on though. Go back. That has to be 2017, probably, DJ. Well, maybe not. I guess I did there did have some okay. I could if it was if it was the like old school, like how to do the tops, the first uh the big six things in Paris that could be possible, but yeah, it was a definitely, uh, definitely did not start daily vlogging until mid 2016. It was June, June, something like June 5th or something. So something I like, Oh my goodness. So much, so much ranking on the OG ness going here. Okay. So anyways, I'm going to turn that off for a second. I'm going to turn on the, beer break sign because I need to go I do need both the bio and the beer so here's what's going to happen uh we can make this actually hold on can we do the this guy with the beer break boom we'll do that here in a second cool so well what's going to happen now theoretically is that I'm going to um well I'm going to go to the bathroom that's not theoretic well that's fan that's that's fact but what I do normally at this point is I go back and I rewatch everything for what I call the polish, but it's just to make sure that it, everything is actually working, <laughs> that it's, you know, just catching little mistakes like misspelling sanity in a title or something like that. Not that that would ever happen. Um, and so I'm going to go back to the beginning and just watch it, which means I've already been a little bit more focused tonight than usual. Usually I talk more um, with those of you in, in the comments than I have in tonight. Sorry about that. Oh, excuse me. That's a burp. Whew, we're just full of just full of uh, vitriol tonight. So not that. That's not what I wanted. I was going to say something else. Shutzba, something. Anyway, so we're going to watch that. I'm just going to watch it all the way through. For those of you that don't want, it's basically a massive spoiler because it's going to be very close to the finished version that you'll see tomorrow. But it's also going to be, you know, started and stopped as I go to, to make adjustments. So it's not going to be watched straight through, but probably at like 80 or 90% speed when you take into account all of the little stops that I'm going to make along the way and I'm going to obs you know, obsessively save it as I go. So um, if you're interested in sticking around and watching with me, that'd be great. And then we'll wrap up from there. If not, because you want to keep it spoiler free, no hard feelings. If you decide to leave now, that's totally fine. Just wanted to let you know what's coming. And uh, yeah, Santa Jay will be right back. 
after a brief moment, a brief word from our sponsors. I should load up like a little video for these breaks. Second beer tonight is the Brooklyn Defender IPA, which is a golden IPA, which I don't know necessarily what the distinction is there, but apparently there is one. All right. We've lost a few people who didn't want spoilers, it looks like. Totally fair. So let's, I'm going to change this guy up. Obviously, we don't need the beer break sign anymore because I'm back. We're going to go back to our editing scene here, which also has the beer break sign on. And we don't need that. And, uh, yeah, let's just go ahead and do our polish here. I think we should be good to go. And then we'll chat again in like, uh, you know, 20-ish minutes. I actually already hate that. Let's uh, grab something a little bit more. We sit on this guy way too long. Something like that should do the trick. A little bit better. I don't like that we have the motion in there. I actually don't like that at all. Let's go like this. There we go. A little bit more subtle. All right, let's see if that works. And also with this guy, I don't like that's not that's, uh let's get one of the one of the close ups like that. I think is cooler. Is that long enough is the question. Drag it out here and see if it works. Yeah, I like that better. I also feel like this guy for the intro does not need to be quite as quiet as it is.
going to. I've never run in this one before, but uh, oh, and there's a, is that a rabbit? Is that a rabbit? I might, it's, uh, it's probably just a rat. <laughs> <laughs> I am in, in Paris, after all. Uh, good morning. Uh, today, it's going to be like a little bit of a project day slash admin day. I've got some work to do for one of the secret projects we'll be talking about sooner than later, hopefully the next month or two. I'll just keep teasing it until then, I guess. I'll start talking about it soon. We'll figure that out. But I had a long phone call with Brian and Andrew about that this morning, and then now, uh, yeah, out for a run, and then I go back. Got to work on that some today, but also I have like three small projects that I want to get done in the chateau just to make my life one step better, uh, or actually it'll make it three steps better as I complete each one. You'll see in a second, but until then, I'm going to keep running. Did you hear that guy ask me if I knew where the exit was? Makes me wonder how far this goes. I think I just committed myself to running an, un an unknown am I'm going to, I'm just going to see. Oh, we'll find out. First thing is the kettle here. It's uh, got a little bit of a buildup, you know, of calcium. There's a, there's a term for it. I just looked it up. Calcium lime trait. <sighs> Apparently, I, I really do need some more coffee. Anyways, this should be easy enough to clean. I thought I would have to boil it with uh, water and vinegar, but it's just like it is said to soak it with like half water, half vinegar. It's perfect. <laughs> that oh, that's one of the things that I bought yesterday or the other day when I was at the store. I bought a five liter jug of water um, to make my coffee with because it should reduce that from happening because we've seen how hard my water is it, it happens really quickly but then we've got this uh, white vinegar that we should be able to use you know to help clean it up which is always counterintuitive because i always think if you're going to use that isn't it going to stay clear but no turns out it doesn't doesn't work that way definitely not as clear as the day i got it okay while that is uh soaking it said for 30 minutes on the fellow website this guy's the next thing. For one, I need to get um, the rack. So I've got, I've got my awesome weatherproof saddlebag here. That uh, was how I managed to get all this stuff back. But it has inside of it a couple of accessories that need to be added. The so shoulder strap is not one of them. The main one is this guy right here, which I'm kind of scared of now that I just opened like that. This is so I can attach the saddlebag to the side of the bike. So that's one thing that needs to go in the back of the bike, which I would have had like them do at the official office, whatever, but COVID. Uh, bike lock also needs to be attached to the bike. And what's this? To the bike. And what's this? Oh, the toolbox. That doesn't need to be attached. Ooh, look at that. There's a special pouch in here. I didn't know that. This thing's not only like supposedly weatherproof, but it has a little pouch in here. Just woke the bike up. It has a little pouch in here uh, for little things, I guess, that you can put in and not worry about uh, getting lost in the bottom. So that, that, that's project number two. So that, that, that's project number two. And as will come as no surprise, project number three is also hard water related and it's just swapping out this uh, shower thingy, which I, you know, I've, I've been procrastinating on for a long time. I don't entirely know why I've been procrastinating on it, because it's annoying. But it's one of those things you only entirely know why I've been procrastinating on it, why I've been procrastinating on it. Sounded like I said that weird, but it's possible, I guess. I was going to make fun of myself and make a title, but it, you know, it's just silly. Annoying, but it's one of those things you only think about when you get in the shower, and usually that's at, like, midnight or something, and you're like, wow, I need to remember to do something about this, and then you never do. At least I don't. But today, this guy is going in the shower. Does it fit in here? No, it doesn't. Well, it's not compatible with the mounting that I have in here already, but you know what? That's just tough. So with no further ado, I suppose we should be productive. It is kind of cool because you can see the inner workings because of the poop plastic, but honestly, the design does not appeal to me that much. I'm just messing with the lights now. Hold on. That make a difference? There we go. So with no further ado, uh, whoops. Thankfully, the guys that put up my, uh, oh wait, can I do this by hand? Oh, wow. I was going to say, <laughs> I was going to say thankfully the guys who, uh, installed my TV left this behind. I did try to contact them. I, I sent them emails. I even called the company that they that sent them. They never came back for it, but I, 
I was thinking this whole time I was gonna need to use these, but uh, looks like I can just. Oh, gross. Use that. Go figure the little washer. Okay. Step one complete. Where's that box? It's all wet. Extra balls? Interesting. And tape? What is this? There are instructions inside. Uh, uh. Oh, it's in English. Very tiny, tiny font. What is this? Oh. Font. What is this? Oh, oh there's extra washers. Oh, there's like a filter in this guy. What? Wait, what? Is there one in here? Oh, did this pop out? This is when I might need the something got left behind. Oh, 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 narsty. Does this belong? Is this like? I don't think this is an old system. Does this belong? I don't think this is an old system. Oh no, don't go down that. Narsty. Oh no, don't go down that. There's a spring involved. I'm taking it off for now because I don't think it's compatible with this guy. Oh no, please tell me you actually fit. Okay, if there's a washer in this guy, then I know I did that right. Oh, there is, okay. Old, old Parisian piping. All right, now to see if it actually works and hopefully. All right, now to see if it actually works and hopefully not ruin my camera in the process. All right, now see if it actually works and hopefully not ruin my camera in the process. That guy's kind of nasty. Also, this is the before I wash it away, because apparently that's what I need to do. That's the stuff that like came out of the, the old, when I pulled that thing out, it had captured all that inside, so that's great. All right, let's see if this works. Oh gosh, that is a lot of pressure. Wow, whoa, How, wow. Okay, I'm impressed. Like the the pressurization in here is actually that's pretty crazy. I should have shown you what the tube looked like without it, because that's nothing. Whoa. Okay. Whatever they did to make this thing a pressure hound, it's a working. Let's try that switch flip. Wow. I'm impressed. I am really impressed. That is a kick. Holy smokes. Okay. Project three complete. I think I was partially intimidated by the, um, like the plumbing element. Like, I'm not so sure that I trusted myself to, I'm, it's, it's not that hard, but for whatever reason, I was a little bit nervous. The other side was that I knew I was going to have to take off my socks, otherwise they were going to get wet. And there's something just about wet socks that just makes me not want to do anything with any project, like ever. Wet socks are the worst. Okay, moving on. This may look like a fairly large space, but as soon as you put a bike in here, you realize it's not. And I'm always having to like squeeze past the handlebars when I'm trying to cook, stuff like that. So, not only do I want to get the saddlebag on this guy, but when I'm done putting it together, I'm going to park it downstairs. Because I'm fortunate enough to have access to the garage, and I never thought I'd actually park a vehicle down there. But it makes perfect sense to do so, especially because like it's just direct access to the street, and then I don't have to carry it up any stairs. Like... Now that I have the electric motor to carry me up the ramp, the stairs, the stairs. Now that I have the electric motor to carry me up the ramp, what have I been thinking? Where does this guy go? Doom, 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 doom. He goes here, and these guys go here, and where the mud guard is. Does not coexist. It has this, and where the mud guard is.
<laughs> Sorry. I don't know if you can hear me burping down here, but the the, uh, the beer is having an effect. Mostly just on the noises I'm making. Something like that. Wait Something a second. Like oh boy, hope it's one of these guys. Yes. Success. Guess we should put this guy here-ish, something like that. Oh, it's got, I didn't realize that it's on the stroke. Boo, turn that off. Okay. Success. Do you want to do it there? No, I want to do it down here. Excuse me. Okay. Do it like that, and then we'll go. Same thing we were doing earlier. We're following. Um, we're gonna invert this. Whoops! Come on, it's so hard to use. It's so hard to do this with the uh, the oversized um, uh, little cursor icon things. We're gonna. I'm gonna figure all this out. Don't you worry. I mean, not that any of you are actually worried, but I'm. I'm kind of worried. I'm going to figure it out. I'm going to figure it out. And we're going to add one there. So it actually worked out that time. Why is this? Is this not filming it? It's interpolating frames or something. Or it's not. It's it's not interpolating frames. But it's. Looks like it is. It filmed it like half. It like 30 frames a second. Because it's like. Takes two frame frames forward to get anyways something's wrong but whatever Success. there we go just a little bit more just a little bit more movie magic for you at home <laughs> A little bit hobbit footy right now. Why is there a gap here? Interesting. Wait, what did I do? So hold on. Before we commit to that, let's go to this guy and see what what was I doing in in here. There we go. Oh, there's some good motion. There's some good motion there. There we go. That that'll do it. out of is it out of focus oh whoops low a low level exception occurred that's good news oh good thank you look at this look at this nice big error box oh boy okay anyways i was trying to i was trying to do this is it gonna let me it's not gonna let me make it bigger at least not let's look at it full <laughs> that's really helpful thank you computer okay i don't know i think it's out of focus just out of focus. Looks like it's like ear tight. As if everything about this bike wasn't ridiculous enough already, I, I got my lock and it, the key has a light on it. Just in case you're having a hard time figuring out how to. There's so many jokes that could be made about this. I'm just going to put the lock on. This thing is so heavy. It's a good thing I'm not going to be carrying my bike up and down the stairs all the time. Okay. 
that's not that's it can't work that way because this guy so I gotta push this oh because I'm doing it upside down that's why now when you want to get the lock lock out oh my gosh Just checking in on our vinegar water here, and it has worked like a charm. Look at that mirrored bottom. Delightful. It's crazy. Look at how much nicer that looks. It's so much better. Oh, you can see some of it floating in the water there. Let's get rid of this. Gold money. It's seriously very warped to me. Because we have to. Gold money. Viola, as the French don't say. Gold money. It's seriously very warped mirror look on the bottom there. I tried picking those little black things up and they streaked. It turns out it was a tiny little charcoal filter. Who knew? I feel better about taking it out now though. <laughs> This is a great example to this shot is a really good example. I'll find it here for you of the stuff you don't see, which is all of this where I set the camera up and then I rode the bike out the gate up, waited for it to close and then came back down. <laughs> uh, life, The life of an idiot, AKA me or a daily blogger or whatever the, we can make this a very nice long, slow build up. There we go. Sixteen, sixteen seems good. This bike is the best thing ever. It's so big. So I don't really need math on these, I suppose. I love this bike so much. Thank you to everybody who pitched in for this bike, because it is the best thing ever. I wanna ride it so badly. Uh this bike is the best thing ever. It's so big. So I don't really need math on these, I suppose. The saddlebag is great. I was able to put my I'll show you. I was really easily able to fit my camera back in here, my little one. Should have done a snap counter. So many snaps and thumbs ups. Make sure that that the, the trifecta of ought. Oh, that's good. Well, I feel like we've earned a nice little sit down and you know, coffee moment. I have a lot of work still to do today. <laughs> it's funny because with the whole you know confinement thing, one of the things I have. And this is going to be satisfying. I have a project journal, and I get to cross off a few things on my list. I was going to make it look prettier for camera, but we'll see. Uh, so let's see. Shower head replacement. Check. Van move rack installation. Check. Van move parking. Check. Although I guess, you know, van move bike lock installation. I'm going to add that to the bottom here. Van move lock installation. Install, check, 
it's just additionally, it's just it's just more satisfying to be able to check off more things. That's basically all that's about. I'm making some pretty good headway here. There are a couple of these that are definitely, there's one, I got to get on top of my receipts and the finances stuff. It's very high priority. Uh, but that's nice because what, what I've managed to accomplish here today is I've made my shower less annoying. And holy cow, the shower pressure. I got dumped some coffee grounds down the drain uh, in the shower just to keep cleaning it. For those of you that are concerned about the stink, I'm pretty sure I've beaten it. Mostly with coffee grounds and um, with I did do one run of the de-block, de-stink stuff that I still had left over. But we'll find out. I haven't done like a full-fledged, a full-force shower, like a like full-on leftover. Leftover. But we'll find out. I haven't done like a full-fledged, a full-force shower, like a like full-on one for a while because I've been trying to like ease my way back into it. Tonight's the night. I'm gonna give it a try. I'm gonna do a full-on, yeah, full like full-pressured shower, and we'll see. On, yeah. Tonight, I'm gonna give it a try. I'm gonna do a full. Do a full. I don't need to stumble over that quite that much. I'm gonna give it a try. I'm gonna do a full, like, full pressured shower, and we'll see if it causes any stink to emanate. But I think I might have beaten it purely with the power of coffee. And if that doesn't, if that doesn't give you a reason to love coffee even more than you may have already loved coffee, I don't know what will. But that feels pretty good to get that done. I, it's also a good way of procrastinating from other work that I absolutely should be doing right now, and I will get to immediately. How, like, how is it going for you so far if you're in France and in lockdown? Obviously, different parts of the world are going into lockdown again. Spain was in lockdown, I think, before us. The UK just announced one this weekend. It's all, it's all a mess. And not that there's anything particularly stressful going on today when you're watching this, tomorrow as I'm recording it. Not that, not that there's anything that might be bothering anybody today. Hoping to get you outside of that for a minute, but the project definitely helped. And it's good because I feel like I'm already hitting a routine. I'm going to run pretty much every day because I really feel like it makes a huge difference for my mental health. Just getting up being active. Getting my bike out of there and downstairs clears up a lot of space. And also I think it's just generally going to be more convenient. As long as I make sure to get the engine on because I was riding it while it was in its off state and uh, it doesn't shift gears as quickly when it's in its off state because it has an automatic gear shifter in case you missed that part earlier. And uh, yeah, you got to work really hard to get up that ramp without the electric motor running. Um, we'll get that figured out. But yeah, having my coffee kettle cleaned out, the shower working and the van move fully assembled finally and parked in its appropriate parking space is a great combination. And I think I'm gonna, so theoretically, I've seen people riding their bikes around and I know that I can uh, go into town for work, which I'm gonna have to do this week anyways because I have to get Kate mailing stuff for patrons. For patrons and- Might as well just throw in a Patreon thing in here one more time. For patrons and so that- But I also didn't put in- like Instagram or anything else, which I might want to do. Accessible. I know a lot of people that are coming into town or uh, moving around town for work. As necessary. I have an idea for that. Um, so. so I'm gonna I'm gonna try and do that. So we will get one bike ride in at least, and hopefully we won't get fined for doing it. And that'll be delightfully satisfying, hopefully. But um, yeah, otherwise I'm gonna try and get into a good routine of uh, still making some of these videos, even if my daily vlogs are gonna go back to being a little bit shorter than they used to be, or a little bit less frequent. Uh, maybe not every day, every day. Um, I'll keep making these. I'm gonna exercise in the morning. I've got projects like this to get through. I've got a lot of stuff to keep me kind of up and moving and, and going. And uh, and that's really that's really the key, I think, to keep staying sane over the next few months. The nice thing is that I'm, I'm in a much better headspace going into this one than I was last time. Going into the last one, I was I was already on the verge of burning out again. I was feeling really overextended, exhausted. Um, you know, I was coming out of. I mean, I was a ways out from the breakup, but like I'd just come back from a trip to America uh, that was that was way too fast and geared towards her schedule instead of my schedule. And uh, Sam, I did just see your comment over here. You go to bed, Grandpa. Some of us have got to work. And was also <laughs> some some of us have got to make videos, Grandpa. And uh, and was also mildly it's, it's a little bit depressing to have made plans with somebody. So like the rest of your comments, it's frozen over here for whatever reason. It hasn't been scrolling, so it's been I haven't been distracted. But for whatever reason, I picked up on Sam's in the corner. Back to this now. And, uh, and it was also mildly. It's, it's a little bit depressing to have made plans with somebody to like meet family and do that whole nine yards and then not do it. Granted, it was of my own choosing, so I'm not asking for any pity on this. But it was it was exhausting in its own way. Also, just found out there's some guys that are going to be doing construction two doors down. Of course, they're going to start doing construction while. I'm stuck here. It's gonna be great. Oh man, this is gonna suck. I can hear them. They're just, they're loud just opening the door. Like, but aside from the little things that are weird. 
But aside from the little things that are really annoying along the way, there was a nice, I have a neighbor that brought me food the other day. I just met her a couple days ago and she brought me food, so that was nice. And I really do feel like going into this one, I don't know, I feel better prepared. I feel not excited is the wrong word, but I feel like I have, I've got a game plan. You know, I know that I'm going to go into this and I'm going to be okay and I'm going to make it through it better than the last time. Because even though we're not certain how long this one's going to last, I think we know for sure that it's going to last longer than they're initially saying. And we have some of the patterns and the stuff to look back on to help us move forward through this next experience. So if anything, I feel like I've got to capitalize on this time just to make sure that I tie up some loose ends, get some stuff done, make some uh, advances on projects that I never get done because I'm making videos. And since my video making capacity is significantly reduced right now, that actually opens up a great opportunity just to get caught up on a lot of little things that otherwise wouldn't get done and it always feels really good to have those done and behind you um, and so in that way it actually makes me feel kind of excited uh, just to get stuff off my list like taxes I'm not excited about taxes but I'm so excited that I get to do my taxes so yeah there you go a little bit of a project list checked off I'm gonna add more to it because I, I know I keep thinking of great things to do even little things like cleaning and so forth and it's kind of silly to call it projects it's more like a honeydew list but since I am my own honey, Gilly's not going to give me anything to do because Gilly's just always perpetually silent. Gilly's not going to give me anything to do because Gilly's just always perpetually silent. She can talk. I bet you she can talk. She's just holding up. But anyways. But anyways, I'll keep after it, and I'll let you know how it goes, and I'll keep you apprised as to all of these little Anyways, I'll keep after it, and I'll let you know how it goes, and I'll keep you apprised as to all of these little projects and more. And there's a lot of fun stuff coming. Thanks to everybody in the Discord server who gave me some uh, ideas of things you'd like to see. If you'd like to join the Discord server, I'll put another link below. I'm going to be more active there, especially as I'm doing streaming and so forth. Just a spot to come and chat with uh, people who enjoy everything that you, whatever it is that you're enjoying about this right now. It's a spot you can show up. Whatever it is that you're enjoying about this right now. right now it's a spot you can show up and do that uh, as well as participate in some fun game stuff that's coming up and I'll talk more about that here in the coming days but for now I am gonna go back to actual sit down at the computer and work work that's why I have coffee and uh, we'll go from there and I'm gonna try really hard not to be super annoyed by these guys shouting and closing and slamming doors in the hallway no promises there though I'm probably gonna be at least a little bit annoyed anyways I'll see you tomorrow oh and thanks to anyways, I'll see you tomorrow Oh, I'll see you tomorrow. Oh, see you tomorrow. Come on, line up. Thank you. I'll see you tomorrow. Oh, and thanks to today's patron producer. This is another thing. This is, I got to sit at the computer to get a, a caught up on all of this. But thanks to Daniela D, my most recent patron as of this recording, about two hours ago. Thanks, Daniela. I really appreciate it. It's really good to have you on board. And thanks to all my patrons, as always, for keeping me sane. And honestly, that's a huge part of the reason that I am emotionally relatively sound right now is uh is knowing that uh it's gonna be okay like i'm gonna be able to pay my bills and eat and focus on making more stuff like this for you to enjoy and hopefully uh we all get through this together however long that takes anywho i'll see you bright and early tomorrow morning for maybe more projects who knows my shower works so at least i'll smell good that is a good point okay and on that note here you want to see let's see how quickly this goes i think you should be able to see um oh yeah so we're gonna render this guy this the beast as it were is a beast and um just watch how fast it renders even while we're live streaming right now i just want to i'm just going to share this with you i'm curious i'm just going to export because normally i used to do like the media uh there's a an additional what's it called the oh, what's called uh you can queue it up in the media encoder which is usually a good way of doing multiple things. And that way you can keep working in Premiere while you're waiting. But I just want to show you like how fast this is going to be. It's going to make the audio previews. And that's pretty fast already. And then it'll encode it. And we are doing multiple things right now where I'm live streaming. Uh, and so it is affecting it. That's actually way slower than it has been in the past. That's still pretty fast though. But it, it, normally when I'm just, when it's, that's all it's doing, it's like insanely fast. The other thing I was going to do while we're hanging out here talking is I'm going to move this guy. Oh, whoa, not all that. We got to, um, we got to dissociate this guy from that. But I think putting this in here is a good.
good idea like that. Move it over. I'm just trying to economize the space. I got plans. I got thoughts. And this guy can move over a little bit too. Look at that. Just making some improvements. I just noticed that while we were working. All right. I'm going to try and get caught up on some of these comments here. Hey, Doc Kelly. Hope you're still in here. And, and Oh, hey, Jenica's here. Good to see Jenica. Speaking of like OG, way back when. Officially jealous of our lockdown. <laughs> Not surprised. Um, yeah, there's a lot that goes into it. Glad that you guys are all here. Yeah, sorry. Yeah, Sam, yeah, never mind. Sam and I, I, I did not mean to spark questions of Sam's age. He's not an actual grandpa. Glad you get here, Janae, to see it. Your girlfriend lives in Paris. Oh, man, I'm sorry you guys have had those cancellations. But, yeah, the Nintendo Switch is a good way of playing games across the way. You should also try maybe finding some friends to play Among Us because that is where it's at. It's pretty great. Editing is way better on my laptop of Doom, for sure, on the Beast of Doom. It is, this This is actually about the speed that it would normally have gone in the past. It's struggling right now, actually. How hot is it? Ooh, it's pretty hot. Maybe rendering it while live streaming was not the best idea. I'm definitely pushing my luck here a little bit. <laughs> It's a rendering is a very, very demanding uh, element to the video editing process and is probably why. Hey, thanks, Andrea Benson. I really appreciate that. Um, it's probably why I uh, go through laptops every few years is because I'm rendering every night, um, which like really superheats things, makes them very uncomfortable. And um, yeah, they end up they end up not doing so great. Um, so maybe I shouldn't have done this while live streaming. That might've been a mistake, but it's, it's, it's progressing. It's not freezing up at least I have. Um, well, I mean, right now I have, I actually kind of have three monitors sort of. So I have two, I have the monitor that I'm editing on above this one. Cause that's what we had to get to. It took us a while to figure out how to make that work. And then I've got this guy running the live stream here so I can see what's going on. Um, just to make sure that everything's running. So this is showing me just the live YouTube feed. Um, Cause on this computer, I can see on the main computer, I can see what I'm piping out, but it doesn't show me whether anything's falling apart or not. And I should probably be watching this on Twitch because I have YouTube back here on my TV. So like I've got, I got it going everywhere. So I can watch it everywhere and make sure that I'm not, that things aren't falling apart. Um, next time I'll watch Twitch on my phone. And that way, I can monitor and make sure everything's running. Uh, having another monitor, an actual another monitor would be cool. But then you would see how slow, oh, look how this render, so this sad, sad render. This is literally the slowest render this computer's ever done. Poor little guy. He's just being so overworked right now. But there you go. You got to see the whole process. Oh, and I didn't change the frame rate. So I have to actually re-render this because I didn't change the frame rate down to 24 frames a second. Ah, whatever. We'll do this one in 60 frames a second. And we'll see how many people leave comments about how, how clear it is. Um, <laughs> that happens every time. All right, so save that. That's, that's that. I'm going to have to build my um, thumbnail and stuff. I don't even know what I'm going to do for a thumbnail, to be honest. I could do... I feel like I should do... Actually, I really like that shot. I like the basement shots. Um, riding around. Okay, so it came after this. Not this one. Gotta love it when it doesn't make any sense. Like this. Like that. I kind of like this one just as it is. Actually, that could be a photo of the day too. What did I get for a photo? I got some photos. All of my photos are like fall photos. So, um, and I don't usually do a photo of the day from, I'm just going to capture this guy. I'm going to do a couple of them. One, two, five, five, four. Is that what it is? Um, we'll save this in here. There's thumb, we'll say thumb one. Oops. Copy that so I don't have to type that all again. And then there's got to be another decent one in here somewhere. Like there's one, when I go straight across, a little bit closer is also pretty good. That that might be a good actual thumbnail because I'm all backlit and blurry. I kind of like that. So we'll do that thumb two, and then I'll make some decisions later. 
but we'll transition right on out to the uh, stream is wrapping screen because I'm all fancy pants like that now. I know it's all there's so much going on. I'm learning and growing and everything. Um, editing. Thing, well, thank you for watching. I appreciate it. Thanks for hanging out. And uh, I definitely I, I'll, I'll work on slowly and steadily building my wall of monitors. I'm sure we'll get there one of these days. It is kind of cool to have the one monitor on top of the other. So that might be how I go about doing this from now on. Um, so we've learned a lot today. We've grown a lot today. It's all been great. Thanks for, you know, your subscriptions and for your, uh, super chats and for your subscriptions again and everything else. I put some stats down here that are both, it's a mixture of, um, Twitch and YouTube, but that's what's going on there. And, uh, Char who cheered the most this time around, Yanni's got the all time high on super chats and, uh, also hit the high on this super chat actually it's a tie it looks kind of like tie between him and and uh mystery man i guess it's doing a little bit of a conversion rate there but thanks to both of you for that and for the subscriptions that came out of this one uh andrea i think is the one youtube subscriber that i got from this stream and yeah we'll just kind of end it there i guess i could have done a little bit more of this music in the background um let's see if i can fade it in a little bit here there we go Awesome. Thanks for hanging out, guys. Thanks for watching. And uh, I'm going to be streaming a lot of gaming over on Twitch. If you haven't followed me yet on Twitch, I can try to pull, I guess, uh, you'll see it. There it is right there. Just look for my name, Jay Swanson, over on Twitch or over on Streamlabs, which is who uh, helped me put this whole thing together, all of the fancy looking graphics and all that stuff. Um, yeah, appreciate having you here. Thanks for watching the whole process. Uh, you'll see this video tomorrow, obviously, and then we'll see how it all starts to look uh, with the confinement vlogging. I'll be figuring it out as I go, as always. But thanks for watching. Thanks for being here. And I hope that you're having a great night wherever it is you are. And I will see you on YouTube, obviously, tomorrow in the same form that you just saw me today. Just in a shorter, more concise, and higher resolution version. <laughs> I'll see you tomorrow.